Okay, guys, we're gonna be playing The Hunter Called Wild. Uh, wait, hold on. No, that's good. I. There we go. Hold on. <laughs> if I full screen this, and then I get out of here. Oh my god. Alright, we're trying to fix this. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna try to get this right real quick. I kind of think that's good. Yeah, I think that's good. All right. Is that? I don't know. Maybe, maybe a little bit more. Nah, it's good. I was. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So we're gonna get into the hunter. Um. I was gonna do some streaming CS2 today, but. I don't know, it wouldn't let me actually do stuff, so couldn't do that, but yeah, we're we'll doing this instead. Um, okay, so I have a task to kill an alligator in Mississippi. I have a gun for it, but yeah, I'll do it, yeah, except, there we go. Alright, let's get... Let's, I can travel over to my place. I have a tent set up here. So the title, and this is just a relaxing stream. I'm not actually going to be doing anything crazy. But I just want to see if I can see anything from up in this tree stand. We'll move after, but I just want to take a look around up here. Alright, yeah, not here. Let's get down here. Um, okay, so we can go... Look at the bunny wabbit. The bunny wabbit. Living in a wetland does have its advantages. Look at the definition on those tracks. Okay. Yeah, so I'll show you guys my setup real quick. Um, the Focus 357 um, revolver that they give you in the beginning of every single game, pretty sure. 
uh, the Ranger 243, the standard rifle that they give you in the beginning. And then a Grelic, I'm not even sure if I can say this right, Drilling Rifle, it's a classic, and I think that might be a DLC. Along with the Vintage 8x42 binoculars, which you start the game with, and then the, blah, 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 blah. yeah, Genius or whatever, I don't know how to say that, 8x50 Night Vision, which is a DLC, I'm pretty sure. Deer Bleat, uh, Predator Jackrabbit, Roe Deer, and Scent Eliminator calls and stuff. So, yeah. Let's see if I can get the inventory stuff for a tent real quick. Okay. Oh, I can't. I gotta get rid of some. I'll put the road deer call back just because I don't think those are actually in this. I need one more thing. <laughs> I'll get rid of this. I don't think we're going to be hunting fox. Alright, so... I will head over here. And then let's just head towards that and see if we can find anything on the way or anything. That's my tree stand, but I'm not getting that. Well, I guess that's not a tree stand. That's more like a stilt house. <laughs> I don't know what those are called. I'm not a good hunter in real life, so I don't know what the things are called. I just enjoy this. Friction! What's up? We're looking for the deer and the alligators. I just put up my fox call. I just put it away before I came out here. Now there's a fox over there. No! <laughs> That's bad timing. I don't even know if there can be adult alligators in this, but on a hunting blind, but I'm not sure. Oh, okay. Yeah, hunting blind. Um, I'm not really after anything in specific. I have a mission for an alligator, but I'm really just after whatever. Just, yeah, I'm not sure what I'm after yet, but I do have a mission to kill an alligator, so that's probably my top priority right now. But if I see something else, I'll also take that out. I got this gun, which I got today from a DLC, but I think I had the DLC, just... Well, there's an alligator somewhere. He's in there somewhere. That was a warning, so he knows we're here, so I'm gonna stop running. When I get to the water, I'm gonna crouch so that I'm not making that much noise in the water. Yeah, but I got a drilling rifle. Which is made for anything from five tier five to nine, so that's for the bigger stuff. He the alligator called from right here, but he could be in the water. I don't know if he's out of the water or not. If he's in the water, 
it's really hard to kill an alligator in the water because if my dog's growling, that means the alligator's like pretty close, I'm pretty sure. They start growling when they get close to an aggressive creature. Yeah, the alligators are really skittish and it sucks because if you shoot at them and they hear like a gunshot, they'll go underwater and they'll just die for like five minutes. It's, it's so long. Oh, but that fox is so tempting. It's level seven. I'm not gonna. Well, there he is. I'm gonna see if I can stick a bullet at him. I think that was in a good place. You trying to be aggressive, buddy? Wait, did I kill him? Oh, he died instantly. Oh my god, that was the perfect shot. I Oh my god, that was perfect. Okay, that was the perfect harvest. That's awesome. Alright. Uh, yeah. I got that mission completed too. That was amazing. <laughs> He died instantly. I thought he was staring at me trying to be aggressive, but he just died instantly. That's what happened. Yeah, that's a mission complete. Uh, I like that this is just a flooded part. It's not even a lake. I thought I was hunting from a lake. This is just, it's over a road. <laughs> I thought it was a lake. Oh, my doggy's growling again. There's another alligator in here somewhere. I don't actually... If I go into the, uh... Codex, I think it's Codex, yeah. Wildlife, American alligator, what's their level? They're seven, okay, yeah, so that's good. What's over there? Something calling that way. It's probably a raccoon or something. You can do this, and if you just zoom in and out really quick, if there's something, like, behind a tree or something, but you're looking at it, it'll still work sometimes, but it's very hard to do for underwater. Alright, so now I'm going to look at the map, and I'm going to see another place, and I'm just going to mark it, and then we're going to head to that. Let's head to the river. That way, it gives me, like, an idea of where I'm going, at least. And then as I'm going there, most of the time, if I see something, I'll kill it. But that's, like, a good way to stay on track of what you're doing. He's 116 yards away, at least. How far is that? That's 160, so he's at least past that. Okay. Alright, let's, let's start heading that way. I love Mississippi for it's just, it's so flooded. Like, I'm in a corn crop, and there's just a lake in the middle of the corn crop. He's fleeing. You better flee. You fleer. Yeah, I was trying to stream CS2 earlier, but it wouldn't let me actually go into a match. I was going to do just some casual matches, like, actually, like, the casual type, because I wanted to just see how it was now, because I know that's, like, the most common you'll find cheaters in it and stuff, and I know CS2 is really bad at that. So I wanted to mess with that, but it wouldn't let me join an actual match. I don't know if it was because I was streaming, and CS2 has, like, a thing against that or something, or if it's, like, 
my account because it's been a while or something. I don't know what it is, but yeah. So we're playing the hunter. And it's an awesome game. I'm stuck in a tree. I'd be scared to stand near a river that looks like this. I feel like I'd get snatched and eaten. That's like scary. Okay. I wish I could check chat without pulling that thing up, but I can't because I have to full screen the game to be able to do it, so I can't do that, but. Hey, it's fine. I just gotta head down the river and keep looking for some. Alligators. That's my dog. Okay. Oh, that's an alligator. Let's try. Try to take a shot on him. I think that was a decent shot. I think that was a pretty good shot. And he did that thing, he immediately just submerged, and will probably stay submerged for quite a while. But this is the time where we wait, because if he dies in the water from bleeding, he will start to float towards me. So I have to wait to see if he'll die, and then I have to stay here to collect the body if he does. But I can still be looking for other stuff, though. Thing. Trash it, what is honestly what? I can't blame the little guys for making the most of things. They're just my as god, adaptable I got it. as us humans, yeah. but they get crap for it. Did I get it? Did I get it? Did I get it? I probably didn't. Oh no way. I think I got it. But I also think it just like dove into the water. Okay. Alright. Well. Yeah, I don't think that alligator is coming out. But I'm going to just keep moving. I don't know where that raccoon went. I mean, I kind of think I shot him and he went into the water, but he he was on top of the water floating, and I don't see him floating. My doggy leveled up. Oh, 
there's not much on the other side of us if we were to cross. I'm not sure. Should we? Yeah, we should. Because it's just going to make me do a circle if I follow the side of the river. Yeah, let's cross. That was a raccoon call, I'm pretty sure. Look <laughs> at my doggy. He's way back there. Oh my god. Raccoons are the scariest call in the game. I keep falling off the bridge. This game kind of feels like a... This game kind of feels like a horror movie with your flashlight on. When you're not using the binoculars or anything. Where are the things? Where are the things? Where'd they be? Should we change maps? Ooh, we could change maps. I feel like Mississippi can be really good, but it also just doesn't have its time sometimes. Okay, uh, where are we at? Yeah, let's head to inland. Let's head, like, over there. I'm kind of, we should, maybe I should put a, let's do a Silver Edge Peaks. Because I think there's going to be a lot more action in Silver Edge Peaks. I see it's name changing, but the map isn't changing. Alright, well, that's, that's apparently Silver Ridge Peaks. Alright, let's do it. Why is it nighttime here, too? No.
fast travel over here and then just check the fields. Ooh, look at that mule deer. That's a four. Okay. That's nice. Four. Alright, let's try to get him. That's that's a really good find. He's a five. Um, my rifle does five. Both of my rifles do five. Which rifle would be easier to kill him, though? This one has more accuracy. It's weaker, though. So if I miss, it's not going to kill him. If I don't hit the right place with this one, I feel like it won't kill him. But it also... It's going to be harder to miss. Okay. 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 I'm going to get him lined up again. And then I'm just going to take a shot. Because he's in, like, the fur perfect place and everything. I think that was perfect. Look at how he's running. I think that was a good shot. Oh, come on, drop. Just drop, drop, drop. Oh, okay. Oh, I hope that was a good shot. Buffalo over there, too. Oh, I really hope that was a good shot. I think uh, if it actually goes down, that could be a diamond. I think mule deer are diamond at four. I think I have one diamond mule deer, but oh, I don't have very long in this game. I have like 200 hours, I think, almost. There's another herd of mule deer over there. Is that one solo? I think that's just one solo mule deer. Just take out this guy real quick. There we go. <laughs> Here's the blood. Oh, it was a vital. Oh, it was a vital. Okay. All right. Track it. Where'd you go, buddy? Oh, he's over there. Come on. Let's go. Oh, I'm so happy. It was a vital. It could be a diamond. I, I'm i not good at... I'm not good at my uh, science in this game, but I think level 4s are possibly diamond mule deers. That's a pronghorn. I mean, yeah, let's just take a shot at them, too. <laughs> I'm just shooting everything right now. Is this poaching? <laughs> Do I go for the three male or the four female? I'm going to go for the four female. It's also piebald, which is nice. I could go for a back of the head. I'm going to use one of these. It's three animals, so I have to use this. Oh. Yeah, 25 to 50 blood. I mean health, so it's probably dead up here somewhere soon. Yeah, it's right here. Nice. And then I think I laid out those other two. So, yeah, <laughs> yeah, the deer. Oh, it's a gold. Three twelve would be diamond. Okay. Yeah, I wasn't seeing your chats for a minute because I was looking at my phone. My phone doesn't seem to be very reliable when it's on um the YouTube thing. It's like not synchronizing as much. I have to just keep going to my um other thing because I think it's better. But I don't know. Okay. And I'm going to go over here. 
and I'm going to get him to hunt the other blood track. Yeah, the guy I shot over here. Oh, that one's a low blood bleed. I mean, that one's a low blood rate. That's not the best. That's going to take a while. There's some bison up there. I'm not even going to slow down for them, honestly. I'm not even going to wait for them to hear me or not. They can run. <laughs> I don't want to mess with bison. There might be some bison at the lake, though. Is he up here, buddy? Yeah, he's right there. Nice. There's another deer. Is it? What is it? It's silver. So that's not my best one. That's not that's not too good. But silver's good. I'll take it. Um, it's a lot of money anyway, so. The money's really good in this, so I'll take it for the money. And then the other one I shot up here. Piebald, I think. I think it was a piebald. And it was also a four, so it's pretty good. I had to go find where I shot it at so that I can find the blood trail. Oh, look at it. It's right here. Oh, that's nice. Did it... Oh, <laughs> I hit it in the lung and the liver. That's a gold. Okay. 98 would have been diamond. Okay, that's awesome. And, it, and is it piebald? No, it's just tan. Okay, so apparently that's what the tan ones look like at least. Alright. Uh, let's look for the river. I mean, the lake, a lot of times there's bison here, but... Not all the time. No, it doesn't look like there's bison here, you know. I'm going to fast travel back to that hut. Because as I was leaving that hut, there was bison coming into it. And then I'll see if they're still here. Okay. What's that? That's a turkey. I really don't really care for turkey. They're just annoying. But if I don't see anything else, I'll shoot that. There's the bison. Okay. Bison give good money, I'm pretty sure. And I have a gun for bison now. I haven't been able to use it yet. There's turkey up there. Let's try to get a little bit closer. I think how it works is you can run to 200 yards away. Walk to 150. And then other stuff. Oh, he's starting to run. No, he's going behind the ledge. I don't like him being behind the ledge. Can't get a good shot. I'm gonna hit him with a whistle. No, because I can't tell him if he's behind something or not right now. What? Did I pull out nothing? What? I can't. I can't pull anything out. You can see in the bottom right, I'm equipping the stuff. What does that? What button is that? What? What? 
Ah, uh, this inventory. I don't understand. I can't pull a gun out. I, I have my hands out, but I can't pull a gun out. There was a buffalo right there. I can't pull my gun out. Mm. Uh. Oh my god, I figured it out. It's H. Okay, okay, I have... Is the buffalo still here? No. <laughs> the buffalo is long gone. <laughs> the buffalo took his opportunity. <laughs> I could have punched it. I don't know, I might have been able to. I should have tried. I think I missed my opportunity there. Wow. <gasps> the turkey's still here. Turkey, I will punch you, turkey. No, I want buffalo right now. All right, where's the buffalo? I want wild wings. Maybe he went down to the lake. I'm gonna follow his tracks. These are his tracks. And he just charges out from behind me and just rams me. He went up there. <gasps> Fresh. Where are you? And he never even knew I was about to kill him because I never got to because I just punched him. I try. I thought about punching him. You said I was going to punch him, so it came across my mind, but it was too late. He's already gone. He's gone. He's like, no. No. I saw the comment. I'm running. I'm out of here. Where are you at, Buffalo? Give me all your wild wings. Put your hands up and give me your wild wings. There's fleeing mule deer. They didn't even give off a warning call. They just started running. It's okay. I wasn't after them anyways. I was after the buffalo. 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 Where are the buffalo? There's the buffalo. Got him. Found him. Okay. Okay. Here goes Muffin. Nope, he's facing me. Can't. What? Why are they fleeing? What is happening? What? I'm really gonna hope on that one. Oh, he's aggressive. I'll fight him. Yeah, sure, you wanna fight? I'll fight. He's aggressive. Sure, let's fight. Sure, let's fight, let's do it, let's do it, let's go. I got some things. Yeah, you're aggressive, you wanna be aggressive? All right, let's do it. He's dead. Wait, what? That's scary. He started running at me and then just died. Oh, I shot him in the liver and the stomach. That was actually a good shot. He just 
He was that guy who didn't even flinch. Alright. Okay. Uh, alright. He was running at me and then he just died. I was ready for a fight, but I guess not. <laughs> That's the mule deer. I want the buffalo. Buffalo right here. Buffalo, where did you go? Buffalo, where did you go? Buffalo, where did you go? I saw something. It's a mule deer. And he's fleeing. But I got a gun. And he's fleeing. But hopefully that hit. No, it did, did, and where are the where are they where are they where are they? okay hold on hold on hold on I'm Batman where are they that's my Batman impression where are they Batman where are they all right oh my gosh I thought it was a stampede it was a chicken it was a turkey it was a chicken nugget. Oh my gosh, I thought it was a buffalo charging at me. It was a chicken nugget all along. That's them, they're still there, really? But they're traveling, okay. No, what am I doing? I can't make that shot. Not even gonna try that. Okay, um. I have a perk point. Let me use that one. Alright, you know what, let's go back to the house and let's make it daytime so that I can see stuff <laughs> without night vision or anything. And then maybe we will find the wild buffalo, 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 buffalo. Let's go, let's make it six. We'll make it 720. That's daytime. Should be. That's morning. Yeah. yeah. Let's bring out these things. I'm curious though. What happens when you bring out night vision goggles in daytime? Oh my god. Okay. Three. Well, this is a three weapon. Honestly, probably shouldn't have shot at them, but I did. <laughs> so. Oh my gosh!
There's no way to turn the night vision off, I was just checking. I'm gonna go for a heart shot on that too if he doesn't move. I gotta reload first. I'm too far, I can't, I can't see him. Oh, they're traveling. Oh my gosh. Okay. But you're not alert. I should probably be taking it slower. But I know they're right over that ridge. But we got a blood rate right here. So I'll follow that after I get these guys down. These are all ones. Okay, they're all ones. So I guess I'll go for whichever one's easiest. That one's the easiest for a heart shot. No, that's faced away from me. I thought it was faced towards me. Okay. Okay, there's new people. That's a three. That's a three. That's our best one. Not, not that. I went in between his legs. <laughs> no. All right, we got this blood drill. Onward, doggyo. What did I name you? I don't remember what I named you. I named him. All right, Kilo. Kilo, onward, Kilo. I'm coming, Kilo. Oh. Hold on one second. All right. Mm. Okay, 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 okay. Uh huh. Onward. That's pretty close. He's right there. Just not that. Was that my first possibly successful? No, I've had more shots. Alright. Is this guy going down anytime soon? He's at 50 to 75. We'll continue that after this guy. I think this guy's going to go down first. Oh, peaky low. Okay, this is a resting zone or a feeding zone. Resting zone for bison, and then what is it for pronghorn? There's pronghorn right here. Did I hit him? Where's the blood? Oh, yeah, it's right here. Oh my god, very low. I suck. <laughs> Oh my god, I suck. 
no organs or anything. Nah, we're not going for that. Oh my gosh, I didn't hit him. Alright, uh, okay. Oh, let's go to Teomora. I know I can get some white, or I mean, not white till, um, uh, fallow. And go to fallow. Okay, uh, let's, alright, uh... wow, I do not have a lot of this map unlocked, alright, let's go for a full ride, who wants to go on a full ride, <laughs> we gotta go pretty far. Wee. Hold on, let's pull over real quick. Stop. And where we want to go? Uh, let's go to that point first, and we'll claim that real quick. So, yeah, we're gonna get this uh, outpost, then get that lookout point to see if there's any more outposts in the area. And then we're gonna go to that river, that massive river over th under the bridge, and a lot of times there's fallow deer there. And then I'm gonna set up a tent there. I think I have a tent on me, but if not, go into this outpost and I'll get one there. The, oh my gosh, it slows down so much when you're going up a hill, though. Yeah, so. Hopefully there's a lot of fallow deer here. But, I gotta get this hut first. Do I have a thing? Do I have a tent on me? I don't. So let me grab a tent real quick. That way I can set that up. Wait, I do have it on me. It's just not equipped. There we go. Yeah, so, okay. So we're going to go here next. And... So we just see if there's anything else there. And then we're going to... And from here, we're going to go down this area, because a lot of times there's deer here, like fellow. Mm -hmm. 
The full legs also feel so good to drive in this game. And the only thing I don't like is how much speed it loses and gains when you're going up and down hills. Like, realistically, it's not going to be that determined by the angle of stuff. It's still going to have a lot of power just in the engine of a full wheeler most of the time. But, because, like, when you're going up a slow, when you're going up a hill, it, like, snail paces you. And when you're going down a hill, it makes you, like, like insane speeds. But, I get when you're going downhill, you're going to go up faster. But when you're going uphill, you're still going to go decent speed from the full wheeler's engine. I mean, it's not that reliant on the angle. Kilo leveled up, so we get to pump that. On way to victory. On way to victory and be on. Oh my God! There's a pig. Hold on! No! 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 Pistol. I shot him in the butt. I shot him in the butt. Get the fuller. Go. Gotta catch him. Catch him. Gotta catch him. Oh. Pokey hunter. Go. Get the pig. Get him. Get the pig. Piggy, I will get you. Is this poaching? Is that what poachers are? I think this is poaching. <laughs> it's a video game, guys. <laughs> Don't tell anybody. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Oh, he's dead. I got him. <laughs> oh, my God. I got him. Let's go. How many? All right, I hit him in the butt. No, that's not the butt. I hit him in the leg. The intestines. I hit him in a lot of things right there. In the, my butt. Okay. Alright, my gun's loaded. So. Oh, hut. That's nice. Nice, nice. Uh, we're not going to need to go to the lighthouse if there's a hut here. Get this and head to the lake. I mean the river. Sorry. Uh, we could go here or we could go here. But I think I'm going to go here first. Which I'm gonna do on foot because I don't I wanna be able to get to the deer before they before they know I'm there. Um how far away is it before I do that? Yeah, only four or five yards, so it's not that far. Um There could also be other stuff in the area before we get there, but yeah. I'm going to try to just get some fallow, but we might end up um, heading up. I know, hold on. I think right here is a really good place for a red deer, but that would take me a while to get up there, so I'm probably not going to do that right now. But that is a really good place for a red deer. A couple of these lakes, actually. Right here is good for a uh, hog deer, I think. I don't actually remember. I think hog deer. And then a bunch of red deer in the other areas and stuff, so... I don't know what we're going to do for now, but those are options. I grew up here, just west of the mountain range. We were a small community of outsiders living in sync with nature. 
No running water and only whatever electricity our generator could provide. People from down in the local town used to call it a hippie commune, but I've never liked the term. It was about sustainable living first and foremost. We weren't just there to not shower and sing kumbaya all day. So when I say the place <laughs> okay. is the heart of me, I mean it. Mum's family can trace their lineage here to the 14th century. And we've accumulated a lot of stories over the years. Some of those are about an animal that holds a special place in my heart. Parkia, I mean European settlers, released moose here about a hundred years ago. And there haven't been any confirmed sightings since the 1950s. But I swear to you, I saw one when I was little, staring straight at me out of a hazy morning mist. Ever since then, I've been determined to prove that they're still here. Okay. I've even written a book about it. Or I'm writing a book about it, I should say. I can't give it the conclusion it deserves yet. Bella. Hold out much hope in got him. Bella. But I've got a few trail cameras scattered here and there. Usually just throw up deer herds and four. the occasional teenager behaving this badly. Is four. But they're pretty low maintenance. One of them got knocked over and the battery's completely munted. So I'd like you to I don't know if that was a good shot or not. I was going for the neck because he wasn't facing me. That was probably a bad idea. Mm. Ooh, that probably wasn't the best of ideas. Ooh. I didn't hit him. Alright, uh, we're gonna head back to the house where my fooler is. And we're gonna go back there. We're gonna get the fooler so we can go further. Yeah, here's the bridge, so right across this we're going to get to that lake, and then from the lake I'm going to put up a tent, and then we're going to see if we can see any fellow at the, at the lake whenever it gets to drinking time for deer. I'm also going to get the camp that's right here, I remember it being there. How'd you get there? Why is your butt up in the air like that? That's weird. Alright. I'm not here. You don't see me. Wrecked. Wrecked. Oh. I got two of them. Let's go. <laughs> Bunny wabbit. <laughs> Bunny wabbit. Oh, he's so cute. He's so cute. Rabbit. Well, you release a handful. Within a month, you've got an entire underground city. These days, a swift dose of TNA is our preferred approach when they get out of hand. But you're welcome to supplement our efforts. Okay.
apparently have a mission at this camp, so. I think Tia Moore probably has the most in-depth, um, most in-depth storyline, but I'm not really focusing on the story right now. I'll do that at a different time. Maybe for a whole different stream. I don't know. But I'm gonna head to the lake for now. Which is pretty far up there. The driving in this definitely gets boring. <laughs> but this is like a realistic game. I guess there's a bunch of that in it. So. gonna try to get to that lake it's not it's not too far off but chicken nuggets in there I heard a chicken nugget call well right, let's go through the through the forest right there at the end because it doesn't actually connect to any rivers so I'm going to have to go through the forest at the end part but that's so tight see right there there's a pig there's a pig kill the pig kill the pig there's two pigs there's four pigs there's five pigs I'm gonna kill one of them I'm gonna kill one of them I'm picking this one I'm gonna kill you piggy I'm in too much bushes. Get me out of the bushes. I never liked bushes baked beans anyways. That's a lie I did at one point, but I don't anymore. Oh, I hit him, I hit him, I hit him. He's coming back for me! Oh, I dropped him. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Buddy, by the time I reload this and I point it at you, you're dead. Got him. I hit him. Alright, I'm gonna collect my winnings from this. I can't get on the I can't get on the quad bike. Oh my god, I hit a tree. Alright. How many pigs did I kill in total? Let's find out. Oh my god, there's another tree. Yeah, so I hit this guy when he was running back at me. That's a good shot. I hit a lot of stuff. Can you tell me if there's more blood in here, buddy? Come on, sniff it out. Nope, okay, there's no more blood here. Well, there should be some blood back there. Any track here?
Um, right here, I'm pretty sure I hit another one. Yeah, I hit him right here. Come on, come track this one, buddy. What are you doing? Get over here. Come on, track. It's right here. Oh, he died right here. I could have done that. Doggy, you were not helpful there. Piggy! Nice. Alright, let me reload these. So that I'm ready. Alright. Let's go. Let's cut through the forest thing. This is the light. Rabbit hunting again. No. Alright, well, I only got one that time. I only got one that time. Oh, that's sad. Get it off the screen. Alright, we're good. I only got one that time, but that's still a win. He's very recently, yeah, I just saw him go in it. There's no bunny wabbits around that white right now. But I'm still gonna go set up a tent. Underwater. No, no, give me help. <laughs> Who knew I was a submarine, a submarine pooler. Hey, let's put the tent here. We have arrived at our destination. Alright, well that's embarrassing. There's no foul deer here. Foul deer here. Alright. <laughs> it's not drinking time for them. I don't remember what their drinking time is. I think it's 11. Is it 11? I think it's 11. Let me check the codex. Ah, uh, wildlife. Fellow dear. When do they drink? They're active. Dawn and dusk. I don't know what that means. What's dawn and dusk mean? Uh, okay. Uh, in medium to large groups. Yeah, so Dawn and Tusk, I don't know what that means, but that's when they're active, so. I think it's 11, no, I'm going to set it to 11. That's just what I remember it as. There we go. Three. There's a three right there. Two. 
two threes. Okay, so here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go in here and I'm gonna go to storage. And I'm gonna pull out something for hunting. A blind, let's do a blind. Um, because when you use a hunting um, structure, it gives you less, like, that's true, they do think, they do drink when they're thirsty, that's a good time, but I don't know, somebody, nobody knows when they get thirsty, that's the problem, hmm. but I think it's 11 something, because I put it to 11, now they're drinking, but I don't know when it is until, okay, let's get in this one. So there's a group over here. Two threes. How far away is that though? Three twenty. Oh my god, those things are so bright. That's three twenty away. I don't know if I can. I don't know if I can do that. That's so far. Let's go for it. Oh, got him. Okay. I don't see the one that I shot. Um, Okay, well, that kind of sucks. There's only one one group here. But, okay, dawn and dusk is morning and night start. But when is that in game? Because, like, night is considered 12 is midnight. But what is considered night and morning? Um, okay, so... Storage. Let me get another fuller out. Oh, and now that I've moved, there's fallow deer. That have heard me and ran off. Perfect. Oh my god, I'm so shaky. Here's the blood. That looks like a low bleed, which isn't too bad. There we go. Yes, yes, Kilo, you were definitely very helpful. You were, you were very helpful, Kilo. You were very helpful, Kilo. Very helpful. Thank you. Oh my God! <laughs> Stop barking at me, Kilo.
<sighs> what other maps do we have? We can go to the yurt for our home guy. You'll see that. Avusheni, grandchild. Welcome home. I know it looks different than you remember. We've, I, we've had some problems here at Voronga Savanna. Voronga. <laughs> I've watched the sun rise and set over this park for 45 years. I've seen miracles of life, wonders of nature you would not believe. Our family's roots here run deeper than the oldest baobab tree in the park. But after 45 years, I'm humble enough to admit I can't be senior warden forever. Droughts, disease, and poachers are a constant threat. My team and I have protected and saved countless species over the years. But after a streak of bad luck, our elephants okay. and all but one rhino are gone. Sir, stop talking to me, sir. Lose more animals. The state could shut us down. Okay. See? No, okay. Not about oh, I remember this. He talked forever, doesn't he? I forgot about this. I want to keep the role of senior warden in my tribe. Preferably my family. So, grandchild, here you are standing. That was a lion. You can protect Buronga. Save the animals who call this park home. Mend what has been broken. I saw a lion right there. This will make our ancestors Who's proud. Running? Spiritually, physically, you're going to face the most difficult challenges of your life, but you can overcome them. It says he's chasing. I Is he chasing me? Talent. I always have. Now, ready to prove grandfather No, 375 to 50, 500 yards away. Okay, that's not after me. Wow, he talked for a while. All right, guys. <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> Shut up! Stretch your legs with some basics. You can finish these in any order you like. Oh my God! Stop talking. Climb the nearest lookout tower. Taking the I'm doing that. Take note of your landmarks and see if you can spot any wildlife. Then I'd go ahead and reopen the nearest outpost. We stopped keeping them up after last year's budget cut. So stop talking! <laughs> find shelters again. Oh my gosh. Finally, show me your hunting skills. Track and harvest an animal of your choosing. Imagine, okay. The quality of it's a lion. Kill. That's my goal. Lion. What rank is a lion? Because I have gun for almost every rank except one, which I doubt he's a one. Lions aren't ones. So I'm pretty sure I can do it no matter what. Two, three, four, five, six. And I have seven, eight, nine. See, so yeah, I just don't have one. This is the emptiest lookout tower I've seen in any map. You see it again, don't you? Oh, he keeps talking. Africa, the land <laughs> he talks too much. I knew you couldn't leave Boronga forever, grandchild. No, I definitely could have. Your family adopted you. I saw the fire in your eyes, and I said, "That child is." I knew I was adopted. Mystical, magical, and now I know I'm right. <gasps> the ancestors brought you back here what? on my behalf. Thank you for That's coming. That's a nine. Okay, the you tears still are nine. Got those other jobs to do, right? Don't slack. Oh my god, don't slack. I'm hunting a lion. <laughs> Chill, Grandpa. Oh my god. Oh my god, I forgot it was a single fire rifle. No, oh, I don't even know why I shot at him. <laughs> I 
All right, <laughs> what can we see, I guess? There's nothing in the savannah. Why did you bring me here? All right, what are other tasks? We got to claim an outpost. We just did that. Oh, you know, that's, this is a lookout tower. We got to get to the outpost, which is a, like a hut. And then harvest an animal. Okay, I can do that. Let's, all right. So, hopefully we can kill a lion, um, but we gotta get to the outpost first. Oh, that's a springbok. Our old friend, the Bronking Springbok. Harvesting springbok is a reliable way to feed local markets and prevent overgrazing. If you can catch them. So there's a two and a three. And I'm gonna see how close I can get. Okay, he's eating. What what are the what is those eating things? Spring bog four to eight, it's six. Okay. Yeah, we have time. I learned from my mistakes. I'm not just gonna take the shot. I have to wait. I'm gonna get a little closer. That's a mating call. It's not a warning call. Okay. I'm gonna try to get close. My scent might be kind of annoying, so I'm gonna spray myself real quick. He's above, he's behind that ridge now. I almost jumped. That would have sucked because it would have 100% scared my most likely. I bet it would have. Did I just say 100% think it most likely would have? That's not something. Okay. Uh, it's only about 100 yards away. Hi, buddy. Use a good kilo. Good kilo. Good kilo. Good kilo. Hey, good kilo. Okay. Onward, kilo. Must kill. Must kill bug. Not bug. Why did I say bug? Must kill deer. Hey, little hare. The scrub hare. Mfundla. Like the savannah and the scrubs, oh as the name obviously suggests. They breed during droughts. And we've had plenty of droughts, so you'll find them zigging and zagging all over. I feel like a savanna would be the hardest place to hunt anything. For a couple of reasons. First, it would be probably the hardest to blend in with anything. But also because I feel like where in most places, if an animal heard you, it wouldn't think of anything. But if it heard, like, footsteps in the tall grass in a savannah, it would immediately think lion. Alright. It worked. There we go. He's right there. Got him. That was a good hunt. There's a fox in this bushes somewhere. Well, I'm just gonna harvest this kill and then go back to that outpost. 300 yards. Um, where did I kill that guy at?
kill me, buddy. Where do you find it? There's a blood. Oh, well, I ran way past it. Okay. Okay, how good's the spring bug? I dropped him pretty quick, so I want to know how I got him. It's a gold. 78 would have been. Okay, I got him with a lung shot and a spine shot. And a vertebrae. Wait, a vertebrae is a spine, I think. Alright, nice. So let's head to the outpost. I um, could not ask more of you. That was perfectly executed. Yeah. Now you just have to do one more thing. Then I have a surprise for you. <laughs> no, I'll spoil the surprise for you. It's more work. Ah, such wow. is the life, eh? Okay, hey, hold on one second. Hey, um, I don't. I I called it a fox. It's not a fox. I don't know what it is. I don't remember. It's like a coyote thing. I don't actually know what it is. I don't remember. But it was over there somewhere, but I don't see it. It might have left, or it might still be in those like trees. But I'm not gonna go for it right now. I want a lion, but it's been a while since I've killed a lion. I think what I should do is I trade. I should trade out my um my revolver that I currently have for that one that's like I don't know if you guys know it, but. I'll show you guys. I'll show you when I get to it. The house is right here, so I'll show you. Ooh, what's that called? Springbok. That is everything I asked you to do. Awe, grandchild. Alright, so here's what I want to do. I want to do that and that oh no we have a problem remember how we lost the elephant and all but one rhino you know what the problem was don't you poor Chaz. they littered the reserve with traps the vusha the eastern land was hit hardest my crew helped the police push these poor Chaz out of the vusha but they left so many traps behind, no matter how many we've cleared, we keep finding more. A junior guide spotted a few of these traps not far from where you started. Could you kindly clear them out? Okay. So I'm going to buy some of these. Because these are really good for, like, everything. So, yeah. Plus that handgun. And then let's go storage. Equip that handgun. Oh, it's heavy. What is it? Two pounds. Okay. Uh, what kind of tent do I want? Oh, yeah, I don't need that. Okay. Let's get that thing out, and then... Is these? I think it's those. Okay, and then yeah. There we go. That's that's good. And let's get that stuff up. Uh, let's get the summer out right there. Ammo type jacketed. All right, let's look at this thing. Yeah, <laughs> look at that. That's cool. All right. Let me see, can I, I have a skill point. Okay. Reveals information about the person. Wait, I'm investigating for its type. And for its type, investigates the survey vegetation. Okay. 
What's that one? Decrease your visibility and plug it away. Gain a 15% health increase. I'm going to go with this one. Pumping that skill point gives me more information about the animal's approximate weight, so I get to see it from its footprints. And then it'll leave more things. More tracks, so I can pick up its fur type. I'm going to do that one. Your dog is naturally more willing to work as it has increased focus. Your dog has a chance to highlight the wooded animal you are tracking. Unlock. That's awesome. What was this one? Your dog has a higher chance of staying close to you. Your dog has a higher chance to friend, find fresh droppings when idle. Higher chance to stay close to you. I don't care if it stays close to me. Unlock. And then I haven't got it to 30 yet. Okay. Can I make it out? Dago boy. Okay. Onward. Do I have any tasks? Uh, travel to the poaching site. Okay, where's the poaching site? That's not bad. That's not far. Alright. This is a really good revolver. I've I've um shot a lion with this. It was a while ago, but I shot a lion and I didn't get any vitals. But I hit him in like I think it was just like the stomach or something, but it wasn't a vital, it was just it hit the skin. But it wasn't enough to penetrate it and it bled out almost instantly and died. Cause it's just it impacts so much. It's awesome. Alright, let me see. I don't see anything. Oh yeah, he's right there. Drop him. Two shots and he's dropped. Nice. Oh, nice. I didn't feel good about that first shot, so I hit him again and he dropped. That was nice. My first shot was a lung and right hummus. Okay, I don't know what that means. My second shot was just flesh. Okay, so I would have died on my first one instantly, but... Alright, it was still a good kill. Hopefully we'll be able to kill a lion today. That'd be nice. But currently I don't have any like tracks on it or anything. So it's going to be pretty difficult. Uh, a couple of days ago what I did was I started from scratch. So I reset my game. Started over. Hamgani, the blue wildebeest, were born to run. And they can run in herds of thousands. Thousands. Unfortunately, they are not the healthiest animals. Diseases like foot and mouth spread quickly among them. So do parasites. We must keep a watchful eye over our fleet-footed friends. Yeah, that's 340 yards away. I'm gonna try to take out this buffalo thingy. 
Wild and beast. Oh, there's a ton of them. I think the max level in the herd is three, though. Yeah, but that's a better looking one. I think I should go for that one. Two. Yeah. yeah, he's not even at a good angle anymore. That one is. That one is. I like that. I'm lined up with them, so I'm just going to get a little bit closer. I scared off the buffalo at that side. I mean, the wildebeest at that side, but still standing like that on that side, so we're good. Alright, I'm ready to take the shot from here. Alright. What was that? Oh, that's another one. Look at them running. Is that him? And did I kill him? Is that him? That's him. Got him. Got him. That was successful. That was a crazy successful. That's nice. That's awesome. He dropped. He didn't even get out of the tall grass. That was a gold. Six more points, it would have been diamond. It was just not big enough. Alright. Mm. So, right over here is our, def our place where we have to go. We just have to clear traps out of it, I think. But, I don't know where the traps are going to be. I don't know if it's just random. I don't know. Oh. Well, that's one. I can't step in it. I tried. There you go. Saving the savanna. One good deed at a time. Another good deed. Here's one. Okay, that's two. There's another one over there. Another good deed. Mhumbi, the side-striped jackal sticks to the woods and the scrub, scavenging from other predators or negligent campers. Unless fruit is in season. When there's fruit, that's all Mhumbi eats. Consider them gentle predators. With so many good deeds, the animals are going to like you. I can tell. That's just a taste of the warden's work here in the Vusha. There are other regions to explore, but if you want to... He talks here, so much. useful. Check your mission log for assignments. Mission log, what are they? Tree of life. If you'd rather continue exploring Boronga, head to my wishing tree. Yeah, let's do Marked it. on your map. Let's do it. There's something important you must do before we go much further. Okay. It's not too far away, four or seven meters. I mean, yards. I would like to see, like, a lion or something, but my eyes keep playing tricks on me. Like, everything I see that's, like, tan, I think, is a the lion for a second. problems facing this reserve go beyond poachers and aging wardens. 
Terabat spirits, Iloko, bringing mischief and misfortune. They only come because our ancestors are so angry with the state of this place. We need to make an effort to appease them. I hit the jackal though. I hit the jackal. But he didn't die instantly, which scares me because if it's a jackal, I feel like if you're gonna kill it, you're gonna kill it in one shot. And it didn't die immediately, so. Might not be dead. No, don't wish that version. No, he'll do it. I've seen it. He'll do it. He'll talk so much. Oh, is that the wish tree? Oh my gosh. Okay. Nah, that's when you combine four slap you saplings and bone meal, and that's what that is. My traditional ways. Your brother thinks so. That's why you had to come back and help me. I have a brother? <laughs> I didn't know that. Set up communication systems, set up all the cameras and the drones. Okay, he does a lot, but he doesn't hunt. And he doesn't believe in Iloko. I hope you are a little more open-minded. I am not open-minded. <laughs> Why have you stopped running? Why are you running? Why have you stopped running? It is not over yet, buddy. Get wrecked. Get wrecked. Track the bloody track. What was that? Lion chasing three hundred forty meters away. Okay. Two seventy to three sixty. Is that getting closer? Two seventy to three sixty. Make another noise. Make another sound. Come on. Three forty. I don't know what that sound was. Oh, it was that. Dang it! I got it. You mm. call it the Gemsbok or South African Oryx is a major target for hunters and poachers. Their horns fetch a deluxe price. Despite that threat, they've lost so many natural predators, their population is booming at an unsustainable rate. It's only 190 meters away now. That's not far. 210. Buddy, we gotta make this kill quick. I wanna get that lion. Let me shoot you, come on. Oh my god, I'm getting distracted. I want that lion. I don't like tall grass when there's a lion around, but there's the there's the thing right there. Right, I hit it. I hit it in the skull. Okay, that's not a good kill. But I'm going for that lion though. I might end up hunting that lion because if I can't find him, I'll find those. I'll follow those footprints for a while. There he is. There he is. No, that wasn't good. That wasn't good.
I need to find the lion footprints. Which one's the lion? That's the lion. Yeah, okay. Oh, this is not a good idea. That says he's going that way. I don't, okay, I don't like this. Uh, the lion's in here with me. Okay, where are the footprints going? There's another set of footprints here. Are they going that way? They have to be. Yeah, okay, these ones are the ones I need to be following. I will find you, buddy. I will find you and I will kill you. Don't you dare rest. I mean, you can if you want. I should probably start walking, so if I see him, I have a steady aim. Where is he? 446 to 520 pounds. Okay. It's a male, so it's got a mane, so that's cool. Okay, I'm nervous. I don't want to die to a lion, but I want to kill a lion, and he could kill me. He could very easily kill me, I think, instantly. This gun does take tier 9 ammo. I mean, thing. Okay, that says he was here just now. Which is like within the last 30 seconds. That's not the same line, because that's 400 yards away, and that. It said he was here just now. That's not him. That's a different line, I think. That might be him, though. The thing with them being a class 9 animal is they leave barely any footprints. I think he, I'm pretty sure he's so much faster when he's just trotting. So it's like every footprint I see that says trot, it's like, well, that's a little bit further it's going to be until I can see him. There he is. Oh my gosh. Where are you at? I can't. I can't take that. I'll miss it. I'll 100% miss it. Let's keep following this line. I don't want to get off to a different one. I want to follow this one. I'm out of very fresh, very fresh friends now, so it's not just now, so it's slightly further. Oh, let me check something real quick. Okay. There's a rabbit. I'm not really worried about them. Prince up here. Lion, why are you lying at? Why are you lying to me, buddy? Where you at? Come on. 
No, he's fleeing. Come on, don't be a scaredy cat. Be a biggie cat. Because you're the biggest of cats. Come fight me. I don't know if that's a good idea. <laughs> yeah, no, sure. Come fight me. I dare you. I'm lost on the prints. I don't see any more footprints. This says just now, but then there's no more footprints. I don't see them. I'm a bit confused on this. Okay. Well, let's go back to the tree, I guess. I lost them. That sucks. Alright. Mm. Back to the tree we go. Back to the tree we go. Back to the tree we go, 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 go. Back to the tree we go, go. Oh my gosh, look at the bunnies. It's a whole field of bunnies. I would never kill a bunny, don't worry. Oops. Oops. Man, that sucks. Didn't mean to do that. That was an accident. My finger slipped. Oh, wishing tree, oh, wishing tree, how wishing, wish you tree. Here's my wishing tree. Of course, this is the first place I came to celebrate when I heard you were coming back to Africa. I played the drum and sang to praise the ancestors. Well, that's then I weird. Put something special inside the tree. It's there, waiting for you. Take it. <laughs> that guy could tell you me how to catch a lion. Yeah, he he could tell me how to get a lot of things, probably. <laughs> Okay, that looks like chocolate ice cream. All right. Carved it myself. Do you recognize Yami Yami? 
The Zambezi call him the river god. He brings his waters rushing, whoosh, searching for his lost wife. Maybe she was a lake goddess, I, I don't know. If we win his favor, maybe he'll help us conquer the drought that's been sucking us dry. Okay. Here's what I need from you. I am not singing. A springbok. Okay. Any will do so long as you harvest it with the highest integrity while you have Nyami Nyami on you. Show gratitude to Nyami Nyami and the ancestors <laughs> on behalf of <laughs> Nami Namavur. And on behalf of the local family that this animal will feed. I'm Nam Namavur. Never sacrifice <laughs> animals for ritual alone. <laughs> the local tribes donated their land to Vuronga Savannah because they rely on this ecosystem for their diet. We have a duty to them. Okay. Um All right, let's head to this water. What animal do I have to kill? Springbok? Sure, I'll accept that. Let's have a look at our mark and your hunter mate. I'm not doing that, I'm going to that place over there. Where does it want me to go? Way over there, what? I'm gonna go there first. I'm gonna go to that ocean. I mean, like, first. Um. I wanna find another lion. I wanna kill a lion. Five likes on the stream. Thank you guys. I wonder if it rains on this game. I don't think it does, but it'd be cool if it did. In Mississippi, it'd be really cool if it rained, because it'd be like, maybe like, you could make the waters a little higher in some areas. It would get a little higher of water or something. Hmm. <sighs> Let's let's track the wildebeest. They're really slow and stuff. Oh, that's very old. Never mind. This is very old stuff. I'm not tracking very old prints. They died at old age before I got to them. I thought it was a lion. Oh, it was so tan. I thought it was a lion. No. <laughs> oh, that's so sad. There's a bunch more stuff right there. There's a four. That was pretty good. That's a four, too. Okay. There's something over there. One. Okay. <gasps> oh! <laughs> oh, that is a jump scare! Oh my god, you scared me! Oh my god! He actually scared me. <laughs> he scared me so much. And that's why I don't play horror games, guys.
My dog scared me just from standing in front of me. Oh my god. I'm gonna think, I think that was a kill, most likely. Oh! That was nice. That was two, two of them. Hold on. Um. There you go. And what are you referring to, Christian? I don't remember what I said. I don't remember what I said that you were referring to there. I got him in a battle all again. He's right here. That was nice. Oh, that's a diamond. Oh, that. Oh, my God. We got a diamond. Oh, that's nice. Double long diamond. <laughs> okay. Nice. Okay. I'll save it. I'll just straight up talk to her, man. 5k? Yeah, sure. Nice. Diamond. Let's go check out that other one I got. Where's my dog? Kilo. Where are you, Kilo? I'm trying to see him on the side of my screen. He's back here. I think. Where? Oh, Kilo. If I look away, yeah, uh, it pops up. He's he's right there. Oh, okay. Thanks, Kilo. Be a diamond. That'd be cool. Two diamonds in a row. 
It wasn't the... Well, there is some stuff Jim's bought. That's nice. I'm gonna try to get pretty close to those gems block before I start shooting on them. I think I had a little bit of internet problems right there for a second, but I think it's good now. That was weird. I'm trying to let it, it's not letting me spot that one in the middle. Okay, it's just the three like the other ones. Okay. All right, that was good. I don't feel like any of those shots were good, which is why I shot him so many times. We're having some bad internet problems right now, though, which is weird. And track. I'm having some weird latency problems right now, where it's like my stream went from a low latency to like a high latency, it seems. Like I'm on a really high latency right now instead of what it was on. It was on a low latency. Where's Kilo? You gotta work in your directional audio, buddy, because I'm hearing you in my left ear. <laughs> Alright, that's not good. Uh, hold on. Talking about the game range for this is not bad enough. Oh yeah, okay, it does rain. All right. Oh yeah, I remember. How, yeah, okay. 
Yeah, thank you. It's been a while since I've gotten the diamond. I haven't this time playing. Um, so I shot that, that gem spot four times, and it's still got a low bleed, so I'm not going for that thing. Um, I'm tired. Hey, right. mm, let's go. Here, I'm going to get... I'm going to fast travel here. And I am going to travel over to that lake. Because last time I remember, that lake has a lot of... Well, can't talk. A lot of lions. Okay. Okay, I'll be right for that. Yeah, I think I only remember it on um, Hershen Field. I don't remember it on any other map, but I do think it probably does rain on other maps. Um, yeah. Okay, what's that? Striped Jackal. Ooh, I'm not going to go for it. I don't like chasing Striped Jackals. They're so difficult to get. Right now, I'm just trying to go to the lake. I think there's a lot of lions at this lake most of the time. Or at least there's a lot of drinking zones for lions. So if you come at the right time, there's a lot of lions. I think that's the thing. Oh. I missed. I missed every single one that just ran by me. I missed every single jackal that just ran by me. Oh. Wait, you're still alive? He's dead. He's dead. He died up here. Okay. I thought he would have died on that first shot. <laughs> he ran through it. Uh, oh, man. Okay. I had to reload four shots now. Oh, it's real little five. All right. Lose one. Wait, what's that? Did that die into a lion? I didn't kill that. Yeah, it won't let me harvest that. That died to a lion. It's crazy that that can happen. That's crazy. Where they be, and where the lions flee. Playing jackal, that's fine. Jackals, I'm not after jackals. <gasps> that's 
That's a level 5 gem fuck. Is that diamond? I don't know. I don't know anything about these things, but that's level 5. Oh my gosh, guys. That's level 5. I gotta get that guy. I gotta do it. Oh my god, I swear if he alerts the other gems box. I don't think he's in that herd, so I don't think he's gonna alert the others. Okay, that's a six. That could do it. That's on the other side, so I'm going to take this gun. Let me get to this hill, because if I'm on the hill, there's no tall grass. I can lay down and take the shot. <laughs> Hi, bud. Yeah, I'm gonna take the shot. I missed! How did I miss? Was the bullet drop? What happened? Am I hitting? What am I? What? How did that miss? I'm so confused. I've got to track that thing down, though, because I think that was a diamond. How? I don't know how that missed. No blood? No. No blood. No, he doesn't get anything. Oh. Okay. What do you mean you're fleeing? I'm fleeing, bro. I'm literally running away from you. That is a heavy gem swag. That is a lion size gem swag. 451 to 529. Dang. Not it. Those are the wrong kind of animals. Those are wildebeest. I'm looking for gems block.
There's a stampede. Best gym spot. That's a call from a gym spot. It might not be the right gym spot, but I'm still gonna go check. Could you imagine how itchy tall grass would feel in real life? I'm sure there's a couple of people who actual hunters who do it but like I couldn't walk through that try to walk through that in just shorts and walk all the way to the other side of like a walk a quarter mile in tall grass with just shorts on that'd be so itchy That's not him. No, okay, so that wasn't the gym spot I was looking for then. No, that's all right. Buddy. Ah. Uh ah, -uh. uh -uh, you get back here. Yeah, I didn't think so. Alright, now I'm just angry. That was just because I was angry. I saw so angry. Oh my gosh. Oh, and I caused a stampede. Gosh dang it. I'm going to... I'm gonna leave it. Should I leave it? Should I leave the gym spot? I'm not gonna yet. I'll give it a little bit longer. Another perk point. Um, are you doing handguns? Are you doing rifles? Are you doing rifle? <laughs> Decrease the wobble wobble. Alright. Let's head back to the lake. There might be some lines there. I don't know. And I, w I wish I could have found that gym box. I, I think it was a diamond. I don't know what it was. It was a five. I've never seen a five before. But I think it was a diamond. I don't know. It was also very rarely showing footprints. Which is just another reason to think it is. Onward. To victory, onward, I'm going to victory. You just see two lines and one scratches the other one hands and one drops.
don't see any lions. I don't seem to be lying. But I don't seem to see any lions. Okay. I don't see anything anywhere. Oh my god. I pulled up the wrong binoculars. Should we go back to Mississippi? Let's take a little break real quick. Uh, like, let's say like five to ten minutes on, on a guess. I don't know how long it'll be, but let's take a little break. There, I'll put on my beer right back. Alright, and just a little bit of a break. Not gonna lie, living in a wetland does have its advantages. Look at the definition on those tracks.
but the friction stays as the fluffy doodle leaves. All right, we're back with food. Cause that makes a happy floof, food, a foodie floof. We're in Mississippi now. Um. Yeah. The home of the alligators. That that sounds better. See, they named it Mississippi. They should have named it the home of the alligators. That sounds better. All right, let me drop some stuff. We don't need the pistol for here. Um, get rid of the call. Well, let's put another one of those up. Mm, okay, inventory. Portable structures. That there. It'll let me put it out here. Okay, sure. Let's do it. If I get out, what happens? It puts me way over here. All right. You gotta make sure you wanna get out of that one when you get out. <laughs> Cause it takes you a little bit to get back in. Alligator. There's an alligator. It's 300 yards away. Hmm. <laughs> He wasn't even phased. He was alerted. <laughs> He's not even phased. Alright. Mm. Nothing else anywhere? Alright, let's get out. Gotta eat some food. I got a cookie. Screw you, Turkey. Nobody cares. I think we're going to try to get closer to that alligator. Mm-hmm. Yeah, a cookie. The last one of a batch. <laughs> I, I'll give the cookie my cookie. I mean, I'll give the alligator my cookie. I'll give the cookie my cookie cookie. I lost him. I don't see him. Let me equip my pistol again, because I don't see him.
Okay. Weapons, put that there. Put that there. What am I doing? I didn't even load my rifle. It is. It's the last one, Friction. <laughs> it is. Nobody can have any more cookies. I took the last one, and I don't regret it. <laughs> I'm gonna kill this alligator. I'll give him a cookie first, though. I'll give him the cookie. The one and only cookie. He probably left already. He was like right over here, so he might not be here anymore. Where's the, where's the alligator? Where is he? My dog's growling though. Oh, he's dead. Oh, he's dead. Oh, yeah. Oh, <laughs> that was perfect. Oh, <laughs> it was only a two, so it wasn't good, but that's it's always nice when they go down so quick because they're tough animals. Oh, that's nice. You know how nice that is? That's food nice. Nom nom nom. How oh, nom nom. Where are the alligators? Oh, I have Emerald Coast. Oh, hold on. I have Emerald Coast because that's crocodiles then. I got Emerald Coast from a bet I did with Friction. <laughs> G 
G'day, mate. Hello. <laughs> Mama Lama with the roos. Yes. Yes, kangaroos be here. They be here. Where did the ute drop you off exactly? Anyway, you're not far from my station. I don't know, they dropped me in the middle of the road. Find the fire lookout tower that's close by and see for yourself. Okay. From there, you'll see clearly where things are. Okay. may not look like it, but you're on private land. This belongs to Soph and her husband. We run a station, I mean a farm. Nummy nummy food. Num num. Nom nom nom. Australia's a massive country, as you know. So it's not uncommon for folks to own huge properties that sprawl over kilometres. To cross several biomes, even. That's why we need to... Um, no, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure that's pretty rare. No. I reckon you won't get bored. No, I am pretty sure that's pretty rare. I don't know what you guys are talking about, but that's pretty rare. I don't think it is pretty common in Australia. Nah, I don't think so. What is that noise? What kind of little squackling parrot was that? My knees hurt. My legs are getting tired. You almost made it. Once you're up there, take a moment to breathe and enjoy the view. You know it's a tall tower when they congratulate me for getting close. That's kangaroos over there. I don't see them, but they said there were kangaroos over there. Oh, right there. Seven. Yeah, that's a rule if ever I've seen one. Be careful. Have you ever seen one? Tough to hit a vital organ when they're on the move. Oh, that's really far away. Oh, got him. He's dead. Got him. Oh, that's nice. That's a nice kill. From up here. Look at how high up I am. The Outback. That's one of the first things they think about overseas when they hear Australia. It's arid and it can be tough out here, especially after the bushfires in the last few years. But it's also a surprisingly rich ecosystem. Oui. It won't let me jump. Of unique and sometimes bizarre species. Did you spot my station from up there? Yeah. Then please come and get settled in. No, you can't just say. Sorry, I can't be there to greet you in person today. I'm out on a hunt too. Okay. She asked me if I saw it and then said, good, now you can go to it. No, I didn't, I didn't say I saw it. I never said I saw it. I still don't know where it is. I don't know what kind of station you're talking about. You had a train station out here in Australia? That's another kangaroo thing. That was a mythical kangaroo I killed, though. These tracks, you can follow them, but don't forget to also look up and observe what's in front of you. Ah, uh, what is there to say about us? Well, Robbo and I are... I never asked yes. that. <laughs> How about best mates? Technically, we're also neighbors, Robbo. But yeah, we both grew up here. Our folks owned the two stations. Gold. In other words, that's pretty good gold. Mates 
because there wasn't anyone else around. I said lived in Brisbane for a few years after uni to try to get rid of me, but even that wasn't enough. That's creepy. Too right. We tried everything. A long distance friendship, crazy jobs, stupid boyfriends. And jealous girlfriends. As a last resort, we each got married. Nothing worked. What are they what are they talking about being the last resort? <laughs> I'm so confused. Anyway, let us know when you're over at Safe Station. Oh, what was that? He's a feral goat! <laughs> species introduced by settlers. Some of them were released or escaped and became feral. Seems we aren't very good at keeping animals in their pens. I don't think I got any of them. Hold on, hold on, hold on. All right, me in real life when they let me go hunting. I'm kidding, in game, in game. Never, I've never, never. Do something, be like an Easter egg or something. Come on, let it happen. No Easter eggs or anything? Alright. I hit a vital organ. He's dead right there. I see him on the floor. That's a gold too. I've been getting crazy kills. Dang. Oh, I leveled up. I got a skill point. All right, we got to go over there. Because right there is a uh, crocodile area, I think. We, oh my God, that's still 700 yards away. I feel like I've been running forever. I haven't really been running for that long, I guess. One second. Okay.
So if you live in a country or a place that doesn't have alligators and they just have crocodiles, is every pond completely safe then? I've never thought about that because crocodiles are ocean animals. Alligators are like pond animals and lakes and rivers. So if you live in a place where it's crocodile areas and there's no alligators, does that mean all lakes are completely fine? Oh, that's a weird thought. We will get there. Yay. We'll get there eventually. Only 300 yards away. Still eating a snack. Why does it feel so empty here? I've been running for so long and I don't see anything. I haven't even heard a call in a while. We're finally here. We made it. With these stupid cars that I hate. Can you bust a windshield? You can't even shoot open the windshield. Welcome to my station. It's quiet at the moment, but it can get a little too busy around here sometimes. I reckon it's sort of a hangout for our community. We even have board game nights sometimes. Hmm. Anyway, your cabin's ready. I've prepared everything for you. Okay. Okay. Uh, let's get a uh, quad bike out. And then we're going to start driving. Okay, both can, crocodiles and alligators can be found in lakes. Okay. Okay, yeah, I wasn't sure because. Oh my god, stop talking! Okay. Oh, oh my god! <laughs> okay, friction. Both can be found in lakes, alligators, and crocodiles. Okay, um. Okay, yeah. I thought lakes were fresh water and crocodiles could only live in salt water though. Would you mind grabbing something before you head out? And the, and vice versa with alligators, I thought. Which one? The one on imposter syndrome or the one on kangaroos? Uh the kangaroo one, yeah. What do you mean by in the hills, Mama Lama?
Okay, they say no texting and driving, and I literally can't read this while driving. Hold on. Yes, both the alligators and crocodiles can be found in lakes. Alligators are more common in Florida's lakes, while crocodiles are rare and can be found in the southern parts of the lakes. Okay. Alright. was joking about what you said. What does that mean? Was joking. Was joking about what you said sound right. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah. Yeah, that sounds right. I just wasn't sure if... Yeah. So there's probably, like... Like, um... Uh, mathematically, there's probably no percentage of a chance that a single lake in anywhere ever is safe. Oh, that sounds nice. That doesn't sound horrifying at all. There's sandbar. <laughs> okay. Yeah. They burrow into the top of hills. <laughs> Oh, I hit something. Mm. That was called a tree. For my biological people out there, that was called a tree. <laughs> I don't know why I did that. I found like a, I feel like wow oh my god oh my god all right stop okay go <laughs> oh my god Red deer, red deer, I will come over there. Don't make me get over here. Oh no, not into the lake. Okay. Onward. Ow. Oh my god. Oh my oh my god. I'm okay.
Drifting skirt. Oh, 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 gosh. Now we're off roading for a whole mile. Almost. Half a mile. I'm almost free. Let me find them. I was trying to find a place that looks like it would have a, an outpost at it. But none of these places do. Like, I don't see any dead end roads or anything that would look like they would have an outpost attached to it so we're just gonna we're just gonna go into the thing <laughs> oh I got the hiccups oh no Is this the place? I think this is the place. Yeah, it is. Main grove roots. Uh, here's where we stop. I'll just keep going a little bit. Get out of the water and stuff. Here's where I'm gonna stop using that thing. I'm gonna use a scent eliminator. There's a crocodile. That's definitely a salty. 
the biggest reptile in the world and highly aggressive. If you don't know what you're doing, you'll be the prey. Just be careful with this one, mate. I could shoot him there. 100%. No, there's trees in the way. Never mind, I couldn't see him. That's a red deer. Red deer. I don't care for red deer. The largest deer. deer you'll encounter in Australia. If you're lucky, you might see beautiful antlers on them. It's crocodile country. This little area right here is all where the crocodiles will be, I'm pretty sure. Like the most crocodiles. Like, I think they're. I don't know. I think there's some places else too, but. This is where you'll find them the most. My dog was growling. Must my dog go growling out though. Hey bud. What are you doing? Why aren't you clever? You're smart. Alright. Well. Okay. I guess. That wasn't. Alright. That alligator stupid. Hopefully at least some of them put up challenges instead of being like that guy. There's a seven over there. Let's go that way. I'm trying to get over to that level seven. I think that's a good shot. I had to reload. Forgot. He's dead. Oh. And he's dead. They're both dead. That worked so perfectly, guys.
Oh my god, that was perfect. That guy got him right in the bone. That was perfect with the backbone. He died instantly. Kilo's growling again. Yep. He's running too. I should have brought a Glock. That would have been cool. 10 millimeter. I'll shoot you again, buddy. It's gonna happen. Oh, I missed. These things are aggressive. Gold. Let's get rid of that silver because it's a silver. Alright. They're very aggressive. I like that they're aggressive. That's that means easy money. I know you're in here, buddy. Come on now. You don't want to see me shooting into that water. You don't know my luck. You don't want to see me start shooting into that water, buddy. You don't know how good my luck is. Why is my dog, why is Kilo getting more angry when I get over here, huh, buddy? Mm hmm? Is it because you're right there? Or right there? Let's try to get him. That's a really good red there, but I'm not going for red there. I'm going to stick with that. I'm not going for red there. Oh, but it's so easy. I'm just going to take the shot real quick. I'm going to take the shot. Oh, no, he turned. That's fine. All right, I don't need him. Where's that gator, though? Kilo, where's the blood kilo?
Okay. Uh, Kilo. Where are you, Kilo? Kilo, come here. Oh. I was like, why does it let me spot Kilo? That's why. There's one behind me. Mm. I'm gonna go this way. I'm gonna keep going this way. I wanna make progress this way instead of getting distracted. Okay, I gotta go this side. So I gotta go behind me and that way. There we go. That's medium. I could co- I could not co- I could so wreck him right there. Shoot him right in the neck, but I want to fight him. Honestly. <laughs> Are crocodiles really more aggressive than alligators in real life? That's crazy to me. I thought alligators were more aggressive. I want to see how close I can get to him before I start hitting him. Should I run at it now? I want it to attack me.
close can I get to him? Alright, ready? Ready, 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 ready. Dead. Oh, it worked out perfectly. I got so close to him. Ready, 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 ready. I'm ready. I wish there was grenades in this game. Alligators go underwater, just throw a frag grenade. <laughs> pistol Boom. That other one's about to pop up too. Watch them. They both about to pop up. Look at that. The other guy's about to pop up too. Oh no, he's dipping on that side. Boom. That's as close as you're going to get. I don't even know if I can get you. I can Gonna get attacked in the process, dang. Nah, the other one's not coming? I thought I got him. Alright. Guess it wasn't enough. Ah, oh, there it is. Look at that. I knew it. He pops out. He's dead. 
I knew it. Two out. Let's go. Come on. You're going to float that way? What? No, I killed you from this side. You should have gone this way. Hey, okay, I'll start making my way over there. Maybe he's coming this way. Don't take forever. I'm going to get tired from somewhere else. I don't, I can't afford to pay my medical bills. Come on. Oh my gosh, come on. You need to learn to stop scaring me. What? No, come here. Come here. Don't run away. He's trying to get away from me. Alright, all my guns are loaded. Head out towards that five. He was somewhere over here. Yeah, there he is. That's a magpie goose. One of the aberrant and bizarre species you can find in Australia. Somewhere between a dinosaur, a bird, and a goose. They're the only surviving species of their family. Alright, we're hunting some crocodiles. Hunting some crocodiles in the Niles of the files and the Riles need no files because they got no warrants in the Riles. Don't want to make nobody cries, but we got no moral in the files. I'm just saying stuff. It doesn't even make sense. Oh! <laughs> Mythical. Huh. That's a nice thing to see. It's real nice. I could hit it. I think it was good. I honestly think it was good. Actually, I have doubts. I think it might have been a little too far forward. I might have slightly missed the lungs. That's level eight. Vital organ hit. Oh, that's a good thing. It's a really good thing. Where is he though? Come on. Wait, do you actually know where he went, buddy? Dang, look at this guy. That guy's a hunter.
I like the hustle. Oh my god, and he's right here. Oh my god. Look at this thing. It's a gold 8.99. Oh my gosh. Look at this thing. Eight thousand to taxidermy? Definitely. Oh my god. That thing is awesome. Five medium over there. Six over there. I'll go for the medium for now. Do you think it'd be better at night? Do you think hunting here would be better at night? Thank you, Mama Mama. Better. All right. Yeah, yeah, come here. I'll send a bullet down your throat. Don't you hiss at me. I'll send a bullet down your throat. Get dropped. Wait, no, he's not. He didn't. Are you coming to attack me? Why have I developed an accent? Oh, wrecked. Oh. So they're both in this little pond now. They're both in this little bed of water. Look at them! Did you see they both just popped up at the same time? <laughs> Look! One! Dude, they both just popped up at the same time! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Let's go! Oh my god! Let's go! Yeah, come here, buddy. I think he stopped there. He's probably gonna get stopped by that tree. I don't know if I can get out of them. Probably this guy, but I don't know about that one. Yeah, nice. Nice. I haven't so far come there. I've gotten a lot of them. Can I see my kill feed? Uh, mission log? Nope. Nope. System. I don't know how to see my log, but if I had to guess, I'd say we were near, like, 12, 12 killed, um, there's a five, Six. Okay, that's good. That's pretty good. He's behind that river. I think I'm gonna full charge him. Ready, ready, ready. Why do I so up so much?
What does that mean, Fiend? Fiend the Hunter, I'm not sure what that means. Well, this is the closest I've been to get bit. When's your body gonna pop up, huh? What was his bleeding rate at? Let me go check. Very low. Oh, yeah. I don't think he's gonna pop up for a while. He might not even at all. That was the closest I've been to getting bit. <laughs> When you're in here for a while with how aggressive they are, you start to hear like footsteps behind you all the time. And you think it's fake until you realize it's your dog. <laughs> I'm getting to the edge of this place. I don't think there's any more for a while here either. buggers are they they were introduced for sport in the 19th century 30 years later they'd become an invasive pest species they're now widespread all over the country i'm not gonna stop for that warning call because it was from a one so i don't really care if he gets scared off or not There's more. Okay. That's a seven. That's better than a one. I've only got two more shots in my rifle. A six. A six. A one. A one. And a seven. So a seven's the hardest. Hi Kilo. Hi Kilo. You good Kilo. Good Kilo. Hi Kilo. I gotta get to a sideways so a uh, point before I hit him. All right, I'm gonna hit him. I think he's gonna bleed. Come on, me boy. 
Come on, me boy. You get wrecked. You get bloody wrecked. And they're both dead. Got him. What? I didn't. I couldn't. I couldn't shoot. Okay. Yeah, shouldn't have tried to kill me, buddy. Didn't work. Oh, he died before you got in the water. That's awesome. Uh, hard shots, headshots plus hard shots. Ah, uh, yeah. Uh, lung shots is what I'm going for. I mean, they're so, I mean, they're kind of stupid, so their brains are small, so that's a hard shot, and their hearts are, like, covered by their lungs because they're lying on the ground. So I go for the lungs. But you definitely could go for a brain. I don't know about the heart with these guys because they're laying on them. So I think it'd be pretty hard to go for the heart. But I go for lungs. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do, right? I don't have any rifle rounds right here. Which is the rounds for, my, for the alligators, I mean the crocodiles. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to sneak up pretty close. And then when he starts getting agitated, I'm going to run in between him and the water and just hit him with the rifle. I mean, the handgun. Actually, I could probably just get a little bit closer and just hit him with the pistol. Yeah, he'd get pretty close. All right, look, here we go. He's aggressive. Yeah, I could punch him. I could try to punch him. I'd be like, hua, 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 hua. That's what I'd be doing. Punch him. I think I cleared the beach. <laughs> I could hit him with a low power rifle. And there's like no power in it though, so he's probably fine. be cool if I could punch an animal or like if I could find a knife and then like straddle the alligator like alligator wrestling and just stab a knife in its neck and yeah huh, that'd be cool
My dog's growling because there's an alligator like right in here. Why are you running into the water? <laughs> Do you have a death wish? You could talk to me, buddy. You don't have to run into the water with the crocodiles, buddy. We can talk about it before you have to... Before you go to those extreme things, we can talk about it, alright? Don't run into the alligators, please. Talk to a therapist first. Don't stand there. You're gonna get eaten. My dog has a death wish. There's all, guys. There's a mythical. Alright, the mythical's pretty good. I'm gonna go for that. I could bring a longbow or a crossbow and hunt these guys with longbows. <laughs> That'd be crazy. I gotta get pretty close to this guy because... I don't want to shoot because I don't want to get the attention of that level 8. Uh, Ow. Oh, he's aggressive. That could actually be decent. Alright, I'm going to try to take out this mythical crocodile while he's attacking me. Ah. <laughs> Just destroy him. <laughs> He's dead. <laughs> I shot him so many times. Alright. Alright, I'm going to lay down here. I'm going to take one minute. Just one minute break. Gotta go use the bathroom. Get me down. All right. Okay. I wasn't eaten. So that's a good thing. So there's a three. There's a three. I don't see anything else. Okay. I 
I got a haircut yesterday, and it was the first time I was able to realize I have a headphone dent, a head dent from the headphones. <laughs> Not even kidding. Like, it's small, but I didn't realize. <laughs> but, yeah, so that's a thing. I had so much hair, I had, like, a COVID hair after COVID. Like, when no one cut their hair, I had that. It was, like, almost below my eyes. But I got a haircut yesterday, and I was able to realize I had a massive headphone dead in my head. <laughs> Not massive. It's, like, miniature. But it's just surprising to me. I have to get super close to him because I only have pistol bullets left. So you need to be not angry at me. Good doggy. He's definitely not going to notice me just standing here. Told you. I've only got two bullets. So we're going to make these count. I'm going to try to lung him with one bullet. The first bullet goes through his lung. That's what I want. I'm going to try to get on that piece of land right there. Right here. I'm gonna leave it at that and then I'm gonna shoot him again. What's the blood like? That's a vital. It's a vital. And he's dead. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Is he not coming towards me? He's not moving. I can't get out there, I don't think. Maybe. Actually, yeah, I can.
first shot right in the lung. That's perfect. So I have one more shot. So I could technically kill another one. This can be very difficult, I think. Can I get out? Okay. And I see more up there. There's a one, a four, and a five. I'm just going to run at them full speed. One of them has to go aggressive. I'm betting. That's what I'm betting. Now nah, come fight me. Now nah, come fight me. Yeah, yeah, you want to fight me? Yeah, you do. No, you want to fight me. I know you do. Right? Why? Oh my god! And I was questioning you. I'm so sorry. He barked. I had no idea why. Now I got it. Alright, buddy. You're dead. I'm out of ammo. I got this. Is he gonna pop out? I'm not going to be able to afford these hospital fees. He's not going to come out either. I got a vital. Oh, yeah, he's dead. He's coming too. He's coming. He'll get her eventually. Puppy, come here. Come here, puppy. Come here, puppy. Good boy. Good kilo. Good kilo. Riding the lung again. Nice. Alright, so... Dang! <laughs> Look at this path of destruction. Alright. So I'm gonna head inland right there. I'm gonna go further on the beach here. And then I'm gonna go inland. And I'm gonna get that watchtower. And then if there's a house nearby, I'm gonna get more ammo. Hold on, I can only hear on my right ear. I mean, my left ear. My headphones are being weird. Jump. Oh my god, that watchtower's up there. Alright, I if I have to. Banting. You don't see them often in this region. And did you know they can be found eating seaweed sometimes? Oh, 
I mean, sure, I'll go for it. All right. Oh, there's a thing right there. Okay. Ah, oh, sorry. I had to do something real quick. Butt shot. Shot him in the butt. Shot him in the butt again. Shot through the butt. I'm gonna stop. That's where's bullets? Bantelope. Banteg. It's a banteg. Banteg, but a banteg, banteg, banteg on a banteg, banteg, banteg on a run. He's around in bad tag. He's around in bad tag. Bad tag, but a bad tag, bad tag. Bad tag, but a bad tag, bad tag. Bad tag, but a bad tag, bad tag, bad tag, bad tag, bad tag, bad tag. Oh. How many times do I have to shoot you for you to actually start running? Why do you keep stopping? If you're getting shot at, why do you keep stop running? I don't understand. Why you got me? There's a guy over there. There's a gator over there. Gator? No. Salt and crocodile. Yeah, crocodile. I'm gonna shoot you in your stinky tail. How you like that? Do it again. Oh, shot him in the tail. Oh, we didn't like it. Alright. Uh, we gotta go up there. Because up there is nice. And... It's where we're supposed to go. That's why. Get familiar with the, the love and iconic vampire goose. Decline. Hunt a fair by attack. Decline. Harvest God for better. Good decline. I mean, you could track blood if you could find it. Sure, you can. Why do they never learn to run? I don't understand. What do I need to do to get you to understand when someone's shooting at you, you're supposed to run? I get it, I'm not that threatening, but I can still do something. Are you gonna attack me? Sir. Sir. I don't have my wallet on me, I promise. Take anything. Take my phone. Not me. Oh, okay. <laughs> no scoped. Oh. oh my god, you are not having a good day. 
I never knew somebody getting robbed could end out bad for the robber. It said invalid target. I thought I was trying to shoot my dog. Do you ever die? I don't understand. I've hit you 40 times. He's coming back for more. Oh, he's dead. Oh, he's dead. I hit him 47 times. Oh my god. Oh my god. They're psychos. They're crazy. How many times did I hit you? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Hit him thirty times. How? Hit him thirteen times. I don't understand. I don't understand. They ran me out of ammo with two guns. They're when we used to put turtles on the back of our places in art. I don't understand. Oh my gosh, there's another one. Hi. Don't zoom in on that. Okay, how? How did I hit the right lung from this side? I went through his arm, through his lung, through his... Not through his heart. Yeah, through his heart. Into the other lung. But I didn't hit any of the things besides that lung. How does that work? I shot it from this side. And I went through his arm, his lung, and his heart. And then hit his other lung. But I didn't hit any of the things in between. That's a glitch. Pretty sure. I wish I had my fool there. But I left it so far back there. I was trying to stream on CS2 earlier today, but it wouldn't let me actually load up any any maps or anything. Because it had been so long since I played, it wasn't sure if I was actually a person or not or whatever. I don't know what it was actually, but that's what it, it says I'm like that. I don't remember. So, couldn't do that. But, I had to come up with a thumbnail for this game <laughs> within like five minutes. <laughs> But it ended up being fine. I ran into a rock. Yeah, I did. Okay. Like, I've just been running without thinking about it, but look at that. I went from down there, top of the mountain, that's this steep. That's almost at the bottom, directly down, and it's 219 yards away. I mean, that's at the very bottom. So, I would say this whole mountain's 118 meters from where I am to the bottom. And it's this steep. I wouldn't be able to make it 10 feet up this thing. Look at this. I'm looking straight right now. I mean, I think that's pretty straight. Like, there. I would say that's looking flat, like straight ahead. 
That's crazy. Four viewers, what's going on, guys? Hope you guys are having a. Hold on, I can dig of some. Hope you guys are having a gaming full great day. Yeah. Came up with that. I like it. I'm gonna use it. I can't get up a hill. Help. I broke my ankle. I'm falling and I can't get up. And if you fell here. If you fell here, it would not be good. Okay, look, you guys might not believe, but I am Mountain Goat. I am. I am Mountain Goat. I'm not the goat, but I am the Mountain Goat. Come on. Never mind. I'm the Hill Goat. I'm the Billy Goat. <laughs> I came from down there. <laughs> How do I get up? <coughs> oh my god. Okay. How do I get up? I'm falling. How? Why is my dog over here? Kila, what are you doing over here? How'd you get here? How'd you get here, Kila? Stay kilo. You need to pet. It's important. Good kilo. Good boy. How do I get up the hill? It's so steep. How long have I been streaming for? <laughs> Four hours, 30 minutes. All right. I'm waiting until it's like at nine and I'll stop. I'm, I'm kidding, guys. Don't actually wait until nine hours. That'd be crazy. I'm not actually going that long. I mean, I could. Not like I have a life to attend to anyways. <laughs> I do. It's just, it's an in-game life. I'm having a gaming full great day. Are you having a gaming full great day? Hmm? Are you? What's better? Tacos or burritos? If you fold a taco, is it a burrito? Is a taco a sandwich? Is it is a is a pop tart a, a ravioli? 
There's a pop tart or ravioli. Are you having a gaming full great day? Is a burrito a wrapped up tarka with a soft shell? This is my ASMR. Welcome to Floof's ASMR. That was Floof's amazing ASMR. I'm gonna lose a lot of viewers for that. <laughs> Is that a watch? I mean, an outpost? Yeah, that's an outpost. Alright. Oh, well, yeah, Chromar, but you can get a soft-shelled taco. And then if you, if you roll it up, is it a burrito? Also, yeah, I don't, I don't think it's very common to like ASMR. I'm not judging anybody if they do like ASMR, but it's not common. Like, it's fine too. It's just very uncommon. I, well, I can't say that. I believe it is very uncommon. I would jump, but I've been bit so many times. I don't have the HP. I've been thinking about weird things I could do with ASMR and I found this pencil and I'm debating breaking it. <laughs> I don't understand ASMR because it's like, is it meant to be slept to or is it just you're one day like you get bored or like school work like homework or whatever you're doing and you're just like you know what i want to listen to people talk like they're trying to put a baby to sleep and break random things or chew on random things or talk in cool ways is it like a thing you do when you're bored <laughs> or is it like to go to sleep with or something i don't understand it but They have to make me go up more flights of stairs to get to my foot wheeler. Let me get a, let me, my doggie's barking, my real life Kilo is barking. Okay, hold on, mm, hand yards.
50 is probably good. And then rifle. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna use these. I'm gonna take a longbow. Yeah. Oh, I can get tracers. Okay. 75! 75 penetration from from 15. That's 75. Yeah, I'll do that. I'll buy more of those. It seems like I'm going to have fun with them. Alright, and then storage. So we're going to carry the arrows, we're going to carry we're going to take these, equip that, there we go, okay. Let's get rid of the ranger. How many things does this do, actually? How many things does zero do? Four through seven, so four, five, six, seven. That does nine, so from four to nine, so everything above four, and then that does two, so then it's just, I need, I'm not gonna be hunting anything with level one. So yeah, okay, so we have everything we need, though. Wait, I'm missing one ammo type. What is it? Is it jacket? I think it's jacket. Yeah. Alright, and then I should be able to equip everything here. Plus the longbow. That for that. That for that. There, there, and then that. Alright, let's do it. So now, we're gonna go hunt alligators with a longbow. We'll probably use other stuff too, but my main goal is to kill an alligator with a longbow. How do I heal? I think I sleep to heal. Let me go do that real quick. Let me see what time. It's 8 to 12, so I'll sleep until 8, because I think when you sleep, you heal. So I'm going to go sleep to 8. <clears throat> yeah, I'm full healed. Nice. Let's do that. Oh my god! <laughs> okay. Oh my gosh.
Oh, okay, I made it. Oh, gosh. Oh, my God. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay, turn. I think the driving is pretty cool in this when you're on a road. When you're off road and it's pretty crazy. Or a mile away. And then we're gonna be hunting alligators with a longbow. can't turn. I've been holding my wheels to the right, but I'm on such a hill, it won't let me turn. Oh my gosh. There's a deer. Attack the deer. Where'd the deer go? Oh my god. Oh my god, I hit oh my oh my god. This is so difficult. Oh, this is the longest drive I've been on in a while. <laughs> We have arrived at Tamba Coast. I'm gonna leave the full wheel here. I'm gonna go go in and foot, going in foot, going in foot, going. We're gonna go in somebody's foot. It's a procedure. Hold on. 
Okay. We've got this. Okay, I'm excited. Let me shoot one time just to see how it works. Do I click it or do I hold it? We, I click it. Okay. I gotta remember that. My dog is growling already. Why are there no crocodiles now? Buddy, you think I can't kill you, but I can hit you with a spine shot and you're gonna die. Yeah, I'm gonna assume that hurt. And we're going to try to kill this guy with a buff. It says its effective range is 47 yards. That we can do. I believe that I am able to get close enough to ping this guy with an arrow. I think it's going to be very difficult. But I think I can do it. I also don't know how the aiming works on this, so I'm gonna get have, I'm gonna have to get closer than 40 yards because I don't know how the aiming works on this. Like when you pull it back, it doesn't give you a rectical or anything. Hold on one second. Okay. Just gotta check on that. Hey. I'm going to stop, wait for him to calm down. Cause he's alert currently now he's calm now I'm gonna start slowly crouching towards him 
I've never killed... I don't think I've killed anything with a longbow. I might have killed, like, one deer once with a longbow. But I think it was just luck. I'm within 40 yards of him. So I'm gonna get over this ridge and I'm gonna take a shot at him. I missed. Got him. Got him. With the fact that I got two vital organ hits, I think it's over. Yeah, look at that. That was a successful bow hunt. That was successful, I think. That was awesome. Let's do it again. Let's kill this guy. Take his stuff. <laughs> I'm acting like I'm looting him. I'm gonna, okay, I'm going to harvest him. And I'm going to go... Let's go get another one. My guy's still growling as if there's another one, so there must be like one in the water right next to me or something. Where are they? There we go, there's one. That's a seven. What was that last one? There's two sevens. What was the last one? Wasn't it a five? It might have actually been a seven. I don't remember. Let's try to get a seven with a bow. That'd be crazy. That'd be actually crazy. I know how the aiming works now, so that's nice. I'm gonna wait for him to calm down while I'm going slow. Apparently he's alert. Now he's calm, I'm gonna stand up and start walking. No, okay, the second I, I can walk on land, but the second I start splashing in water while walking, that's too loud. Now I think I'm in the proximity where if I'm even walking on land, I think it's too, too loud. So I think I, now it's to the point where I have to crouch slowly in the water, speed crouch on land. But I don't think it's any faster than that. Now it's alert, so now I'm going to say it's slow on land or in water. I'm going to say it's slow on land and then probably quick crawl in water, honestly. The water is really not helping me out with the speed of this currently.
He's gone aggressive. Oh, now you're running. You thought you were so tough. And then you just decide to run. I should have just shot you. I should have just shot you with a rifle. In game. Dang. Alright. I think we're gonna start hunting with the rifle again. There's a seven right there. I'll try to get a shot on him. He is laying in the right angle for us. And it looks like the area is clear to him. That's perfect. Okay, uh, let's head over there, see if I got anything. I don't see anything. I still don't know if I killed that crocodile over here or not. Uh, sniff, maybe see if you can find any blood. I think it was in this area. Oh. Oh my god, you scared me. Oh my god, he scared me so much, okay. I'm gonna hold the pistol out and I'm good. Oh, gold, that's pretty good. Okay, um, I keep focusing so hard I'm forgetting to talk. Alright, so we gotta duck down. Duck down, duck down, duck ducklings. Dodo ducklings. Oh, no way, I did actually get the second one on that shot. Nice.
Oh, he turned around. I can't get across that. Oh, that was my alligator. I forgot to go get him. If I shoot a couple of times out of the air, does it make crocodiles more aggressive? Hey, I'm gonna try to cross the river here, and then get. A, I'm not gonna get those ducks because I really don't care for ducks. But I'm gonna try to get to the beach quicker, because I think we can do some serious stuff at the beach. Okay. Um. Yeah, mate. Do it again. Do it again. I dare you. Do it again. Oh, that was an alive alligator. I thought, okay. He's not about to be. These rounds are free, so I'm gonna fire these off instead of my other ones. I'm only doing that because I think they attack more when you make more noise. But it also, it doesn't seem like it. Yeah, I don't know, I'm a little confused. But I'm gonna keep going, trying to get to that beach.
And there's a five crocodile right there. And a one, but we're gonna go for five, of course. Here's the question though, do we do it with a bow, pistol, or a rifle? That's right. Ha ha, I didn't know if I could cross it or not. I could. All right, we're across. Dead. That's a decent level. I believe it was a five. I'm not quite sure, but I believe it was a five. Mate, I will kill you too. I bet. Yeah, how's that feel? Okay, I got this one too. That was that was good then. We're almost to the beach. Are you coming for me? I mean, I don't mind. I'm fine with it. I'm just surprised. You're not gonna make it very far, mate. And yeah, you're dead. I don't know why you did that. It wasn't very smart. My dog's still growling. There's another one in there. Dang. Got another pork point. I'll get that again. Alright. Uh, dog? Yep, he's leveled up. No, because I want to be a type of predator. So I want to be. I want to be able to be attacked by him. Because I think it's fun.
as much as I want to kill the fox, I'm going to ignore it because I'm going for gators. On the beach, I think it's going to be a lot easier to kill uh, alligators. Or, I mean, crocodiles, sorry. With a bow, I mean. I mean, I'm talking about a bow. I think it would be easier to kill crocodiles on the beach with a bow. So I'm getting to the beach right here. Uh, right here. There's going to be a bunch of uh, crocodiles all the way down there. So I'm going to try to get a bunch of bow kills. There's one. Six. Six. That's good. That's really good. So let's try to sneak up on him. He's already alert. That's just because I was running a second ago. Oh, there's two right there. One and a one? I don't really care. Now he's alert. So now it's at the point where I need to quickly crouch. You good now? You happy? You got enough. Alright. You really had to do that? What? Well, there was. Okay. He's mean. Yeah, so now I can speed, speed crouch to him. In a minute, he's gonna be alert to that, and then I have to slowly crouch to him. See, now he's alert to that, so now I have to slowly crouch to him. Um, and then he's going to calm down, and then he's going to get alert again. And when he does that, then I have to slowly... Then I have to s quickly crouch. Hold on one second. He did try to eat me. It was it, He was very mean. He tried to eat me. Is this guy going to stay alert? I need him to calm down. He's still alert. He's calm. Okay, he's calm. So now, if I slow crouch to him. No. No, okay, so now I'm at the point where I have to lay down and quickly lay down to him. <laughs> quickly lay down to him. That's not a speed. See, so that's slowly down, and then that's quicker. He's still calm. How how close to him am I? I'm within like I'm like forty yards, I think. I would assume I'm forty something yards away. He's still calm. The hill is going to be to my advantage because of the bow from the uh, drop. Arrow drop. I'm going to try to stay kind of behind him so that when I get up to shoot the arrow, he's not going to see me. Okay. He's still calm. I'm going to try to kill him with a bow, just because I think that's going to be the hardest way to do it. Alright, right here, I'm going to sit up. Okay, I want to get more that way. Got him. I think he's going to bleed out. No, it wasn't a vital. No, it wasn't a vital. No organs hit. Oh, I got to do all that again to a different alligator. I mean, crocodile. Oh, man. Mama Llama, what has you bow got this? I can't, I can't make sense of that. Sorry. Are you saying the bow's got this?
Oh, what about it? There's Bantag. <laughs> what is Bantag? I think they're being alert by the alligator. Alright, well, I can't kill one with a bow if he's in the water, so I'm just going to kill him real quick. He should die from that. Oh uh, no, I can't I can't go after them when they're in the water because it won't actually let me in the water. Hold on. Wait, I <laughs> Okay. Lake <laughs> so got this. But Bo. I don't understand. <laughs> Come here, Mr. Crocodile. Hey, there's a five. That's not bad. Fives are pretty good. There's a six in the water. I think I'm gonna actually shoot him. Again, I can't kill him if they're in the water, so there's no point in trying to get him with a bow in the water, so you have to shoot him when they're in the water. I missed. I didn't, well, I, I hit the right place, but it was so far behind the water, the water stopped it. He's still completely calm. I mean, he's alert, but he's not even moving. Bro. Bro, you're not even gonna hear or feel the water? How are, how are you still so calm? Alright, I'm gonna go for this five with a bow. Yeah. He's still calm with me. He's still calm with me running. In a minute, he's going to be calm to me walking. See, now he's alert. So now if I'm walking, he's going to be calm in a minute. So if I stop, he goes, he's going to go to calm eventually. Oh my god, you're taking forever. Okay, now he's calm. Now I can walk and he shouldn't get alerted. It's like certain ranges. Now he's alerted to that. Now I have to quickly crouch. Now I'm going to stop. I'm going to wait for him to go calm. Oh my gosh, this is so difficult. Now he's calm. I'm going to quickly quick walk. I want to start going into the grass so that I'm like on his side more. The thing is if I touch a shrubbery, like a piece of a bush or something, it's going to be extremely loud compared to the sand. 
He's alert now, so now I have to slowly walk. I mean, crouch. See, like, if I touch that plant, it'll make a lot of noise. I'm gonna wait for him to go calm. Still alert. Now he's calm. Now I'm gonna go slow. Now he's alert to that. No, now I have to start crawling. Oh, that's the worst phase. So I don't make a noise when I'm crawling like this. If I stop, it's cool, because I'm not making a noise, and I'm not visible, so then it's just animals will smell me. But if I'm slowly going, I still make no noise, but I'm invisible, kind of. He's still alert. What? The fact that he's still alert when I wasn't even moving for a minute is crazy. Okay, now he's calm. It's been a while since he's been calm. He finally is. I'd be so horrified if there's snakes in this game. Like, imagine you were going this slow, and then all of a sudden there's just... Nah, I don't want to think about that. I think that was an actual good shot. Yeah, that was a... That was a vital. Look at... Look at... Look at... Look at... That was a vital. Yes! That was a vital! He's gonna die! Die! Quicker, please. Hello? It's me. Please? What? What? How? How does he have a very low bleed rate? I hit him with a... What? There we go. He's dead. He's dead. He's dead. Yeah, yeah, he's dead. He's dead. Let's go. Let's go. Bronze, okay. We got one diamond uh, in the beginning of this when it was in the savanna. It wasn't a crocodile. I, don't, I think it was a deer, I don't remember. Alright, well, since none of these guys are good, I'm gonna run at them with a pistol. I'm actually, no, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna sneak up a little bit so that I can get close to them. And then I'm going to start running. Because I think that's how you make them angry. You start making a lot of noise within close proximity of them. I think that's how you get them angry. Like aggressive. So I'm going to wait until they're calm. Actually, I don't think he's going to get it calm. He's aggressive. I got that one to be aggressive. I'm going to bow him. Bow him down, boys. Bow him down, boys. Oh, I hit him. <laughs> I hit him. I 
So even though that level one's uh, closer to me, the level four is gonna get alert quicker. See, he's alert and that one's not because it's a bigger level, so he's better. So I have to walk slowly, 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 slowly. Imagine bringing like an AK, like twenty-seven in here, an AK twenty-four. I mean, and just into a game reserve with crocodiles and then just brrr, killing everybody. Not everybody, sorry, sorry, YouTube. Every 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 animal. In the hunting place. Not everybody. Every every animal. That's what I meant. Alright, I'm about to get up and just start killing these guys. Now let's go. My God. <laughs> okay. Wrecked. <laughs> Get wrecked. I leveled up. Let's go. I think we ran to the edge of the where they're gonna be. All right, let's get. A, we got a skill point. Stalker. Um. I don't need that. I'll do that again. All right. So, awesome. how long have we been streaming for? I'm curious. Five hours, thirty minutes. All right. I want this to be a really long stream. I don't know why, but all right. Where are we gonna go now? I think there is alligators up there. Yeah, there's crocodiles. There's more crocodiles over here. I just gotta keep going. Put in the comments how long of a stream you guys want this to be. I think... Hold on, how long? How long is it? Currently, we're at... 5 hours and 30 minutes. I could probably go to 7. But... I don't know. Oh, ooh, ooh. I would go for some different animal. We've been hunting crocodile for a while. This might change some stuff. I would definitely go for one of them. There's a four. That's the biggest one. I'm just doing this so I can see which everyone goes alert. Because I'm not sure which would go first. A four that's further away or a two that's closer. Turn. Turn, buddy. Heart. Go for the heart. Yeah, that was a miss on the heart. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, that was a miss. 
Alright. Dang it. I'll go check, but they are 9, so... They're level 9, so if that wasn't a vital, I'm not even gonna go for it. Yeah, it is a long stream, but I just... I don't know. I had a lot of time today. It's my it's break in school. We got a whole week off, so I figured I'm gonna stream almost every day. I'm gonna try to stream every day, but I might not. And I mean, it really doesn't matter how long they are, cause I have a week off, so it's like I I don't feel like I'm gonna rush to do anything. So yeah. We could go back to the savannah and try to get some more lions. I don't know. Hmm. Kilo. Hunt. Hunt Kilo. Oh, it was, it was a vital. Alright, I'm going for it then. Hunt Kilo. Hunt. Is that a high? No, it's medium. Dang it. Kilo, where'd you go? Oh, he's right there. Okay. Oh, nice. He's right there. Oh, that's good. I still want to follow my dog to him because he'll get the XP for it if I follow him. Nice. There's a gold. Oh, it's only 10 off from being diamond. Nice. Let's let's go for some kangaroo. We could definitely do some kangaroo. Let's do kangaroo, 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 kangaroo. are gonna be over here. Look at those things, kangaroo. I still have a cookie. I still have a cookie. It's in a bag. I haven't ate it yet. I still have a cookie. <laughs> I want to eat it. <laughs> I just haven't. Alright. Uh, okay. What? What? Okay. Right, that's the book. Great job. You're the best. Oh, flat out right now, so I reckon you'll visit Robbo Shelter before I do. You have no idea how stoked Robbo will be when he gets it. Alright. Your first task has to do with kangaroos. There are areas that are badly overgrazed because of them. Good thing I was about to go hunt There's some more kangaroos. There's east of my station, so why don't you start heading there? We'll bring you up to speed on the way. Which way is east? Alright, over there. Yeah, I can do that. That's a mile away? I ain't doing that on foot. I'm gonna fool her. Turn, turn, okay, 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 turn, okay, okay, all right. Okay, I, I completely zoned out. <laughs> Life heaps harder for other animals, 
and throw the whole ecosystem out of whack. Not to mention the economic impact on our stations. Can't say it's been too brilliant the last couple of years. Get wrecked. Oh, you want to fight? That's what I thought. He wanted to fight. He wanted to fight. He wanted to fight. I saw it. I saw it in his eyes. He wanted to fight me. She wanted to fight me. Sorry, that was a female. He wanted. She wanted to fight me. There's just too much population control to be done. You can't keep up on your own. So we often work with the government to hire professional hunters to help us out. Oh, I didn't see that. Mama Lama said seven more hours. I can't do seven more hours. I can get it to seven hours, but I can't do seven more. She's the chair of our hunters association. Yeah, we organize hunting parties with other hunters when we have the time. But most of the time, you all like to just hang out at your bar. That's part of the fun. Our community's not too bad here. Turn. Ow, ow, ow. Robbo, he turned his folk station into a wildlife sanctuary a few years ago. Taking wounded animals, we nurse them back to health, and if possible, release them back into the wild. And you arrange guided visits with schools. That's when Robbo gets to talk the kids' ears off about the wildlife. I know. That's the best part of the work. And most of the time, they listen. Well, you think they listen. Oh, I probably shouldn't have wrote a fooler here then, should I? You really wanna go, mate. Watch this, you about to be dropped. Yep, it's beautiful. Yep, it's definitely beautiful. Oops. 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 Oh, that sucks. Ooh, didn't Robert, mean to do that. Did you submit the codex entries for our local species? Right, <laughs> just finished them last night. If you want to know more about the room or any other animal, it's all in there. Oh, we'll give us a call. Either way, we know you'll do your due diligence. Bro, that's like reading an instructions time. manual. I ain't doing that. Uh, the room's mostly what we're known for overseas. That and deadly spiders. And fair enough, it's a very important cultural icon for us. But it's also a the spiders or the kangaroos. Can be both aggro or skittish. As a marsupial, it displays unique behaviors and movement patterns that you won't find in any other species. Just one example. Don't try disturbing kangaroos at close range. Or they'll know how to get rid of you. He said example like he was going to show me and then just told me what to do. Huh. Oh, I missed. It's time to introduce you to one of your main tasks here. Invasive species and pest culling. We have heaps of them in Australia. Some are native. Quite a few were introduced. They come in all shapes and sizes. I'll show you my tea fields. You'll see the mess pests can do and why they're a major problem to both the ecosystem and the economy. I've tagged the location on your hunter mate. Can't wait hey, to see in action. 
Oh, you haven't? Oh, yeah, you have. Oh, my God! 2.9 miles away, and it says 92 minutes by foot. Alright. Sure. My calves. My baby cows. They're called calves. It hurts. My calves hurt. My calves. Probably shouldn't have left my fool over there. It didn't really occur to me as I was leaving my fool that I was leaving my fool there. Hmm. Well, that sucks. <sighs> Guys, I gotta do it. I wanna kill it with such overpowered gun. I don't even see it. My magnification isn't even enough. Alright, it gets to live. Alright, hold on. Back in the 18th and 19th centuries, right. people thought it would be fun to bring deer over and hunt them, just like they did back in Europe. <laughs> okay. Up, they thrived in their new environment and started competing with native animals. Okay. Within a few generations, deer populations were out of control. And that's just one of the many biodiversity challenges we have. Just in the last decade, we lost tons of threatened species. Alright, oh, hi. A warning, what you gonna do? Oh yeah, look. I like how they give you warnings and then they start running. I think a warning so that you know it's about to kill you. It's that, that doesn't seem like a warning. What'd it go? It's a warning that it's about to leave your sight is what it is. Ow, ow, ow. We've killed two kangaroos now. Come on. Time, any species will become feral. Usually two to three generations tops. Uh, what about humans? Yeah, you'll find mostly huh? feral pigs and feral goats. Right, Both but what about humans? Invasive pests in Australia. Right. All right. They destroy everything. We don't talk about them as much as rabbits or feral cats, but we should. Yeah, but like, uh, what about, uh, like, uh, what the about, uh, is, yeah, humans? It's feral, <laughs> it's okay to shoot, because you'll be doing nature a service. They ruin pastures, crops, orchards, I've been shooting everything that's not feral. Also a major road hazard out here in the bush. I've been shooting, like, everything, even if it's not feral. And you've been watching me through a body cam and you haven't arrested me? It seems like something's wrong with your punishment. Two point nine miles away. All right, sure, let's go. <laughs> oh my God, <laughs> that's so far. Onward to victory, it's ah. Hold on, hold on. Yeah, I'm fast and furious, boy. Hey, right, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. All right, ready? I'm in a parking spot, right? All right, I'm doing the fast and furious thing. All right, so I'm in a parking spot, and I gotta go that way. That <laughs> that wasn't cool. All right, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm in a parking spot, right? I gotta go that way. <laughs> god dang it! I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Kilo. Oh my god. Oh my god. 
Alright, 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 alright. Uh, no, no, I'm done. I'm just gonna make it worse. No, I'll try. I'll try, I'll try. I am in a parking spot in Fast and Furious. And I gotta go that way. Wait. Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> On what to victory? My arm really itches, and I don't know why. Maybe it's because I've been sitting at my computer chair for almost six hours live streaming. I'm going crazy, but it is okay. Ow! My folder's halfway broke down. That would really suck if it broke down halfway through a drive. Oh, it's gonna be so nice being on a road. Wait, hold on, can I actually follow this? For like a minute, oh my god, this road is so short. This road is, okay. I'll go that way. There's no road in between it or anything. There is another leg workout area, though. Wrong way. I still have a cookie. I need to eat cookie. I still have cookie. I forgot to eat cookie. It's in a plastic bag still. Forgot to eat. Has to eat cookie. Has to eat cookie. Eating cookie. Currently in process of opening cookie. Opening cookie bag. Grabbing cookie. E biting cookie. Eating cookie. All right. I ate cookie. Was good cookie. Recommend homemade cookie. <laughs> I 
I recommend all cookies to people, unless you're lactose intolerant. <laughs> Oh my god! Stop! Just roll it back. Stop. Just talk about. I'd be like Mario Kart drift car racing in here. DwightForward.com. I'm hunting pteranodactyls. <laughs> I'm hunting pteranodactyls. No, not in the lake. No. Oh. Kilo, run. Run, Kilo. Run, Kilo. I need to turn that way. Thank you, Guido. Ow, 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 don't know. No. No. Ow. You know, I think that's pretty normal. I think that's a thing a lot of kids do. And when kids do it, they get migraines. And then in a year or two, those migraines turn out to be concussions. And that's that. I told this story earlier in the stream, but a lot of you weren't here and stuff. So, I got a haircut a couple, like yesterday, I think. Maybe yesterday, maybe the day before, I don't remember. But, I had a haircut yesterday. And I hadn't realized until I got a haircut, because I had so much hair, that I have a head dent from that, from the, uh, headphones. I have a headphone dent. Like, it's not a lot, but it's obviously something. <laughs> I did not think I had that. But I guess I do. Ow. Let me just check. Do I need to be on this side of the river or that side? I need to be on that side, so I gotta cross here. The quad bike's almost broken, too, so... Stop. Okay, okay, okay. I'm getting better at this whole driving thing. I'm not old enough to have a driver's license anyways. 
Oh no. Kilo. Kilo, we have a problem. And it's not between us. Ah, uh, there's gonna be a forest fire. Okay, whatever. I'm leaving it. I don't care. Forest problems aren't a fire. Forest fires aren't a problem. They are in the real world. They are in the real world. Forest fires need to be advised. Don't do that. I should actually be hunting, so if I can't ride the fooler anyways, then there might actually be stuff if I'm walking. Look at that, we haven't heard of animal in a while. What is a Javanian Rusa? What in the world is that? Hold on one second. Alright. What is a Javanian Rusa? I think I just dropped that thing. Yeah, it's right there. Dang. Dang. All right. <laughs> that was a nice kill. Hi. No, come fight me. You're a scaredy cat, Rangaroo. Rangaroo, Rangaroo, Sangaloo. I'm turning my back so you can fight me. Nah, alright, whatever. Sue it yourself. You don't get to be a pro boxer and you never will be. I could have trained you, but you decided not to. I could train you to be the best kangaroo boxer you've ever seen. But no, you didn't want to. How ungrateful. You made it to the tea fields? Nice one. As you can see, the damage can be pretty bad when certain species become overabundant. 
That's why pest control is a responsibility everybody shares in Australia, even non-hunters. But for that, you'll need your varmint rifle. It's waiting for you. Good killer. It's the perfect caliber to hunt small to medium animals. The only thing we'll ask is that you take a small target practice test. Oh my God. Test our hired hunters' skills and competence. Even pests need to be shot ethically. I've been your hunter this entire time. You've seen my, you had a body cam on me. You've seen how many things I've killed. You don't need to put me through a test. What? See, I wish I had a grenade. I would just lob it up there. Just lob a frag grenade, maybe a poison grenade. Knock it out. Walk up there, just aim at the ground and go. Phew. That'd be awesome. Throw a poison grenade up there, walk up there, and instead of conscious, you just aim down and go bang. That'd be awesome. Kaboom! There should be more happening when you shoot the water. I'm asking too much. I'm asking for too much. I'm asking too much from this game. And it's a good game. I love this game. It's a, it's good. I mean, the grenades are mostly joking, but I asked for the water thing. Yeah, it's good. It doesn't need more. What? Are you just now running? I just shot the ground, you eastern dang kangaroo. Gray kangaroo. <laughs> I didn't mean to say that. I meant to say Eastern Grey Ganger. Alright. Um, okay, never mind. Okay. I don't understand games. Like, how do you expect me to get up there? Do I have to go all the way around? Come on, let me up, let me up, let me up, bro. Let me up, bro. Let me up. Alright, whatever. Nah, you think I'm gonna let you flee. I'm not.
Oh, get dropped. Oh, get dropped. Oh, get dropped. I missed. Oh. Oh, get dropped. Oh, get dropped. How are you still up? I'm so confused. You want to try me? Let's go. Oh, get dropped. Oh, get dropped. Oh, get dropped. Oh, get dropped. Took out a pack of them. All right, one. One. Two. Three. And then four. Wait. Four. Lego. My ego. Whoa. I don't have it equipped. Dang, calm down. I don't have it equipped or anything. Slow down. Hold on, I'm just refreshing chat real quick. It should be real quick. I don't know why it's taking so long. Hello, Streamlabs. Why are you taking so long to refresh? Hey, right, whatever. Steady six, <clears throat> ah, steady six viewers. Thank you guys. What's going on? Uh, okay, so storage. Is this the one they're trying to give me? No, I think they gave me this one. They gave me that one. I'm so confused. I don't understand. Twenty-two, two fifty. Twenty-two, two fifty. Twenty-two, two fifty. All right, there we go. There we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And twenty-two, two fifty. Right there, there we go. All right, we got it. Finally. 
Bro, I can do it with an iron sight. I don't even care what they have planned for me. I can do it with an iron sight. How far do I have to be standing back? How close can I be? Let's up the ante a little. Try to shoot that target. Still using the rifle, of course. What target? Oh. Okay. Not bad. So, what do you reckon? To me, it's practical, reliable, and lightweight. It may not be the most common caliber for pest hunting, not even in Australia, but it's my personal favorite. Sometimes it's nice to just focus on yourself, your posture, your breathing, your aim. So, if you're game, you're welcome to keep honing your skills. The best hunters are the humble ones, if you ask me. Now that that's settled, feel free to do what you do best. Here's a bunch of bounty assignments for you, but no rush. We'll leave it up to you how you want to plan your hunts. Thanks for your help, mate. Did I just technically, like, complete the tutorial, but they gave me a couple extra missions if I want the XP and stuff? Is that what happened? I think that's what happened. Okay. North of the river, it's mostly my property. I can't wait to show you the sanctuary. Wait, Robbo, I've got an idea. How about we take our mate on a little detour? No, 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 you just told me I was free. We could introduce you to a fun tidbit of Aussie culture. A folk song called Waltzing Matilda. Ah, yeah. Good idea. Perfect. What have you got in mind, Soph? A billabong. Right. I know which one. Check out that location I've marked. If you're a bit of a history nerd like me, it'll be worth your time. I'm not... That's why I have an F in history. And I'm in the beginner's history. No, I'm kidding. I don't actually know what I'm in. I also don't know what grade I have in it. But I don't pay attention. <laughs> Sorry. We should have led with that. That's what we call a kind of U-shaped lake or waterhole. Right. We have Aussie terms and phrases for everything, as you've noticed. But believe me, we're already toning it down for you. Hey, um. So, what's your plan, Soph? Oh, please tell me you're not gonna sing. Sing? Oh, oh no way. But I'll gladly talk about the song and what it means. Gosh dang it. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> yeah, I feel better. I wouldn't want to relive another... 2012 karaoke debacle. That just sounds cringe. And she's not even going to say anything. Okay. <laughs> okay, sure. Just doesn't <laughs> say anything. Okay. You guys know that uh, Hullet in... In this map, there's a uh, certain look. I mean, to me, <coughs> oh my god, it will always be that one bloody song Soph was always singing in the back of her mum's car. <laughs> yeah, sorry, it drove you nuts. Okay, now I used to oh have my this god. illustrated children's book based on that song when I was a kid. Yeah, you went through a phase when you were slightly obsessed with a song. Let's put it that way. Are you done? Okay, they're done. I think. Give it a couple more seconds. Alright, they're done. So what should we do? Uh, I say... We go to something like Hershenfield or something to end it off real quick. Let me just look through the maps real quick. I don't remember them most of the time. Don't 
I have this map? No, I don't. Let's go to Field. Ah, crap. My, crap, my knuckle. Ow. Bleeding. No, no, I'm not kidding. Not actually bleeding. Alright. Where am I? What? Um. I haven't played Hershenfield. Okay. I did not realize that I haven't played Hershenfield. Since I reset. Okay, sure. Hey, let's go. Oh, it's one of those. What tier are you? Three. It's not in the right thing, but I'm still going to do it just for the fun of it. The boat is on the right classifications for this, but I'm still going to use it. Okay. I really didn't. I didn't even add a vital. I suck. Okay. Sure. Go for it. <sighs> Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, he's dead right here. I could put I could put that music as my um somebody subscribe music on the stream. If you want to get your bearings, <laughs> there are lookout points spread out all over the reserve. I cannot seem to spot that fallow deer that I was talking about, or that it said was there. I cannot see this fallow that it said was here. Okay. Um. Attack. I knew it would do that. I wasn't actually trying to. Quite 
point of view, isn't it? From here, you can see a lot of great hunting opportunities in the nearby area. Rattenfeld is a favorite region for a lot of hunters. The fallow deer is such a classic animal to hunt. But we also get a lot of history buffs here. To the south lies the Hirschdorf Hügelgrab, a grave mound dating back to the Bronze Age. Be sure to stop by one of the outposts. They're essentially base camps. That's almost what everybody said every single day. Alright. What are we looking at? Can we see anything from here? No, I don't think so. Were those footprints there before I came in here? I think there's a new footprints. <gasps> Ow! Not expected to hurt that much, Jesus. Validate. Okay, that says old. I'm confused now. Alright, those are two different sources. Alright, that's fine. Alright. I'm going this way. Where the animals be? Yeah, 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 where they be? Where the animals gonna be? Where are they gonna be? Well, any one of you could have made, like, a warning call before you decided to run. I didn't know you were there. If I did, I wouldn't have ran up to you. Any one of you could have decided to make a warning call before you decided to run. Alright. I mean, fair. Fair play. I keep feeling like I'm hearing stuff, which is why I'm going so quiet. I think most of the time it's just my dog walking beside me.
Be sure to shoot one of those guys. That's them. Okay, apparently there's a boar pretty close to us over here. So I'm going to sneak up on this guy and maybe get a bow saw off. I don't know. I'll kill the ducks if I don't see the if I don't see the boar. Alright, I don't see the boar, so I'm gonna kill a duck. Wait, I have this. Alright, we killed it. It wasn't pretty, but we killed it. For the end, do you guys want to see my trophy lodge? No, we'll do that for a different stream or something, I don't know. We'll do that for a different thing. But, uh, we are going to have to wrap it up. We're going to harvest this stuff and stuff, but... Nice. Okay, guys. We are... Six hours and 30 minutes into the live stream. That's going to be it for this live stream. Um, I will see you guys in the next one. Um, but yeah, thank you for everybody who was in the live stream watching as a viewer or those who actually hit the like button, which is also extremely helpful. Uh, thank you guys and... I'll see you guys next time.